barrio. Diferentes voces, diferentes corazones, pero una sola pasión. Dale niño desde lo más alto, vámonos. Se ven los guerreros, se nota un King of Fire. Aquí somos de barrio derroto, a quien le caiga. Internacional donde vaya, esa es mi casa. Viva México como el Ramón cuando gana. Soy el quinto o el secreto, lo oculto desde la esquina. De niño veía delito jugando la maquinita. Esquivo como el Kyo, tu combo da mucha risa. Nenita me ven y gritan, hay algo de la latina. Crecí en la calle, te roban, lastiman, matan. Todo cambió y yo sigo subiendo escala. Piden el humo, yo viendo como inhala. No hay falla, mi luz resalta, se espanta cuando ataca. Yo tengo hambre y nadie que la aplaque. Crecimos pobres, tortillas, frijoles, no vale. Una garrafa ni misiones que yo no aguante delante para motivarte, se puso interesante. Estamos listos para la guerra, lo que sea. Mira, tú parte la puerta. Ahora dime que tú eres. Siempre hablan, pero en persona se desaparece. Estamos listos para la guerra, lo que sea. Siento. Mis zapatos pesan, marca del lobo, te falta tuerca Y nada más te cualquiera, peca, carrera muerta Para la delincuencia, el barrio seca, que no se mientan Llega la tormenta, la siento cerca, ya nada me suelta Estamos listos para la guerra, con quien sea Mira tu parte la puerta, ahora dime que tú eres Siempre habla, pero en persona se desaparece Estamos listos para la guerra, con quien sea Mira tu parte la puerta, ahora dime que tú eres Siempre habla, pero en persona se desaparece Wait, 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 one more time. Are we waiting for some KOF 15 top six action? What are we doing here? Thank you. That's the energy I need. Keep it while we get these players at it before we start the action. Can we please get the legendary E.T. to the stage? Yeah. All right, can we get Lassen up here? Lassen, come on up, Lassen, let's go! Yeah! And here comes an absolute staple, no stranger to this danger, Mad K-O-F! Another legend takes the Evo stage in multiple games, but this is his prime, Zhao Hai! Hai! All right, I need, I need everyone to make this a loud one. Make some noise for Wero Samia! And one more time for our final top six competitor. Give it up for more. All right, crowd, give it, yeah, give it one more crowd. This is your KOF top six. Let's hear it. All right, commentators, Hellpox and Cole, let's get this started, boys. All right, baby. I do believe it's time for some more KOF 15 here at this beautiful EVO 2023 weekend. I am your host, Hell Pockets, joined by the mysterious one, the powerful one. It's been a long time, brother, but once again, we are together again. Colt and Max, how you doing, brother? Oh, I am fantastic. Yes, I am El Colt. The voice is loud. The accent is thick. And the hype is boiling under the skin. We are here to raise our voices, to call for the glory of these champions, because we are playing the game of the people, the humble people of this world, KOF! And I know the crowd is ready, man. They've been getting ornery out there. They've been getting hype in their seats. They're walking around. They can't have enough. And they're about to just get a little bit more. 
It's time for top six, and what about a line? What about the lineup we got up here? Man? Oh, the lineup is fantastic. So many countries being represented right here, and this is the story we will be living today. We are going to witness these champions become legends on the Evo stage. We have people from Korea, from China, from Taiwan, from Mexico, from Japan. Five countries fighting for their legacy on this beautiful game. That's a, pretty, that's a pretty big spread, brother. And honestly, man, there was a couple names that were in the polls, the brackets earlier, uh, didn't quite make it. Most notably, ZJZ, previous year's EVO champion, did not make it into the top six picture, so there will not be a repeat from that, man. But the EVO Japan champion, Xiao Hai, is here, sitting pretty on the winner's side, looking unstoppable. Also, we have, of course, Lasset, who was part of last year's top eight, for all the way from Korea, that fantastic maiden kun, it's back, and of course, Shermie, so he is going to be very, very dangerous. Can't forget about the Ashes either, man. The Ash was clutched the other day, and we expect to see more of that from him. Matt KOF returning to KOF Top 6. Another Finals Evo day, champion. the original KOF EVO champion That's here to reclaim the crown, possibly. I can't wait to see it. That's right, and there, there you go. They are here, ready to dish it out. We are going to see from X Gear ET, from KOR, Lasset, ready to fight each other. Oh man. Speaking what? of previous EVO champions, ET, the KOF 14 EVO champion back in 2017, also reaching, grasping for the, the, the crown, but he's got a lot of work cut out for him. He is still building that onslaught that he calls offense. And we cannot forget that last week in Mexico, he was unable to win. Mexico. Yeah, man, third place. Mass Factor X, baby. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So he, of course, wants to polish that tarnished ground. Oh, the selfie. Yeah, oh, let's go. That's how he lures, lures you to a false sense of security, man. Mm. See, Lassit is the kind of player that wants to, like, hug you before and after the match. But during the match, he's just strangling you for yeah, 20 yeah, minutes. Yeah. Pressure, absolute pressure that Lassit will be bringing. But here we go. The characters are selected. We will be part of history at this top eight. Start, let's make some noise. Hagan ruido! I got no predictions here. Let's just see how it shakes out. Reactions are plenty coming. Oh, it's gonna be fantastic. Let's go. Oh, he looks nervous. This is how we start. You take a breather, a moment of silence, a moment of peace. Y yes, get a lot of oxygen, drink water right now. You guys are gonna need it. Somebody get me some water, by the way. Yeah, please. <laughs> but here we go. It's going to start with Isla again. Maiden Kum, the sleepy boy himself. So here we start. And of course, ET is going to try to start his own offensive with this series, trying to already push Maiden Kum into the corner. So Lassit starting to defend in this moment as Evo starts and kicks off. Not a ton of damage mounting up yet, but at the same time, Lassit in a bad position, stuck in the corner. ET unrelenting with that offense, but finally got slowed down a little bit. Psych! I was kidding. Hard knockdown. What's for breakfast? Oh, oh, finally, great grab to get out of there. And now you're in the corner, but <laughs> with elegance, with style, with so much hierarchy, ET just get out of the corner just like that. That jump D is literally just designed to cross up, so when she's in the air, you almost got to guess, like, hey, is it going to be left or right, depending on the button she presses. Okay, now it's Chermy time. <laughs> Everybody would love some Chermy time. And here, Lassif is unable to start any kind of momentum. I was gonna so, say, Sherman may not even get no time here, man. Oh my god! This is oppression, absolute pressure it's against the race. corner. From corner to corner, from coast to coast, Sherman can travel. Oh! Okay. Finally. And now you have to deliver as much damage as possible. We're gonna see the activation and some loving hugs breaking the back, and the people are loving it. This is exactly what Lassif needed just to get some rhythm back in his step, to get some balance back in his life. Not gonna kill the Isla, but still one more touch to do it. Oh! Trade! ET will take that all day. No, not the day one. Oh, we jump. jumped those. We're jumping back, pressing the button. Execution, I idealization by ET. And only oh. Ash can save us. But the problem in pockets is that Ash doesn't have a lot of money. Does not have a lot in the pocket right now, so he's got to play this a little bit frugal. Okay, great. And the there with the projectile. Ash Crimson, can he be the hero Lassif needs right now? A hero to Korea. The, an the anti-hero, as it were. No, for sure. Stealing everyone's powers. Let's see. But that's oh, in the past. Gonna oh, do it. he's going to do it. I like it. Get it where you can, brother. Oh. And here we go. Great conversion over here. 50%, only one bar. This is the gold for last. Ooh. Oh, yet again, the catch-up. Sadly, there is no, no resources to keep going. That is a 
courageous play against a Bijanay sailing in on you like that. Yeah, you are completely right. The, the Buccaneer Queen is really making some moves at this moment. Oh, the slap! Respect me, boy! Oh, oh the edge here! What a challenge over there by uh, E.T. E.X. Hind getting great representation here at EVO 2023, and oh man, that might be enough because he's got two more bars yeah. to work with. Yeah, That's yeah, gonna yeah. do it. Oh, such a beautiful girl, so a deadly character. Bijanette, the queen of KOF right now. Remember, she doesn't have any like full body ground based reversals. It's gotta be an anti here. So you're completely right. Poor girl. The privilege right here. That's what you get when you did, uh, dedicate your life to piracy. Mm -hmm. ET looking pretty sharp though. Lasted kind of caught on his heels the entirety of that game. Uh, gonna need a big adjustment here. Gonna have to start out stronger, faster against the Isla. At least not get pushed into the quarter as quickly as they did previously. Okay, back into it. We have the first point. Oh, I didn't mean that literally. Yeah, he went forward and uh, tried to vet everything on that launch punch. Oh, no! But now gets open up and against the corner yet again, again. Checking on those foot, checking those ankles. And E.T. is simply relentless. Yo, oh, oh, what a oh no, oh, no, he's out of options. I'm in your mind, boy. You show me a man that wake up reversals, and I'll show you a man that's run out of ideas. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Now, Shermie, she has to shine. Lassit needs her. Ash, to be honest, was uh, quite fantastic, but mm. he needs the second character to do something just. E.T. is not allowing that. Great block. And we've seen over some there. amazing things from Lassie Shermie over the, not over the years, oh, just over the no! past weekend, honestly. Why that drop, that opportunity that Lassie has to deliver a big punish, he's not taken. Still got three bars to work with, though, no activation. No activation. He's trying to, to save the resources and playing footsies right now. Don't blame him, really. He wants to kill with the next touch, so he oh. wasn't sure he wanted to spin three bars. <gasps> there it is! And this is what Lassie needed. Perfect. And the plan worked. 37 seconds on the clock. Shermie's going to get at least 70% back. And that means he has three bars to fight this Vigenet. So let's go. He's Let's take, witness this. I was going to say, it's going to take a lot of challenges to slow down the PGN, but then he just got clipped with the far C into the many, many missiles. Okay, the wake up grab. I like it. Pushing forward on the same side. And low checking, checking it down and then going up. Yeah, Shermie actually got some of the best low Bs in the game, honestly. Goes low profile. Low D also really good. Great uh, distance on that. Comes up pretty fast as well. <gasps> That's going to hurt. Yeah, this is the chance that Lassie's needed. A lot of love, a lot of cocks. Mm. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Level three. Let's go. Why not, right? Why not, right? Do it! Why not? Who would be that girl right now? Okay. The meter exists to blow it. Mm. Burn it, I say. So one more. Close. Oh! He woke up and grabbed He her. unflapped! Why? Unbothered! How would you do that? Just wake up, grab. Said he should have killed me when you had the chance. You know you are playing KOM 15 when you wake up and grab, that's for sure. He tried his best, but the Ash coming in with one bar, not a terrible situation here, but it's going to take a while for they actually get... What? What? He, he convinced him. Mm. He, he clutched that. That was, uh, that was odd. That was odd. <laughs> yeah, to be honest, yes. Ready? <laughs> Are you no entertained people? Oh, we're entertained for sure because the Cronin's on the screen. Four bars. Everybody loves the Cronin anchor match. Yeah, man. This is a gun well loaded. Four cartridges on the mega scene. You want to talk explosions? You want to talk about fire? Is there it is! Oh, oh, I didn't jump. think it was going to catch. I thought that was a little bit outside. Bringing the guns. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to go forward, trying to push. How are you? Two bars for the Ash, though. You better believe if he gets the low B at any point, he's going to activate. And he's also trying to get that third one. Oh, oh that's going to be it! It's enough. It's going to be enough. Level one, let's go! ET, it's going to move forward into the winner's finals. Last hit will have to survive. Outside. I, I think they is it three out, I, I think they three out of five. Et trying to make up his own rules on the floor. Wait, wait, what's going on? It's, a little bit of a it's two out of three. A little bit of a discussion between the judges and the players. Yo, he mixed yeah. everybody <laughs> in the room, bro. <laughs> oh. And E.T., he was honestly believing that there was still a little uh, extra path to walk. He said, no, no, you can come back for a third time, bro. I got a little bit more left for I you. Wanna, I want to <laughs> keep playing with you. Come on. <laughs> match the burn, match rematch. I want more of that, Ash. Come on. Sadly for us, it's only a two out of three until the, the finals. Could happen again, though, because Lass is not out of this yet. Yes, of course. He's going to survive in La Fiesta, La Pachanga, that place called the Loser's Bracket. 
the party where no one wants to leave and everyone will be fighting to the nail to stay in that spot. What a way to start this uh, top six, my dear help out. I knew they were gonna come out swinging. I knew they were gonna give us all they got at the beginning. These guys do not hit the brakes ever when it comes to playing KOF and ET just demonstrated it all over Lassid. Beautiful play and absolutely needed, you know, because I imagine like we were talking about with Smash Factor X, he definitely wants to pick up where he might have been lacking previously. Yeah, he yeah, seems he to be tightening up a little bit of those weaknesses that he had. Yeah. So I'm excited to see him move on, but we got to move on as well to Mad KOF versus Shao Hai. And this is another Evil Champion. Mm, evil Champion showdown right now. Yeah, that's just an incredible situation. Of course, let's remember that fatidic day with the yellow t-shirt where oh. Mad KOF became champion of the world here at Evo, and of course, uh, Shao Hai, who is not shy to that kind of scenario. The, the night that started it all, and Shao Hai, also Evo champion, 2014 e KOF 13 Evo champion over Tokido. Man, this is actually a monumental clash of titans right now. Yeah, they are at the, they are at the element. This is their primal environment. These are hunters. These are predators on their field, and everyone, it's a prey for them. So oh, I'm let's, telling you right let's now. Let's watch it. Shall I right. actually, oh, look at that. He's bringing it yet oh, again. Oh, no, man. I can't believe that thing still looks as immaculate as it does right now. He's been folding it and unfolding it. You don't deserve to watch that stick. There's no rips in it. There's no creases, nothing. It's still in perfect condition. Well, of course it is. It's always in the box. It's always in the box, pristine condition. You can't, you do not deserve to watch this. I think he only whipped out the stick today, man. He's like, hey, where's my golden stick? It's time. Techno it's time, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this technology, man. Look at this advanced technology brought to you by Kwamba. Digging the bedazzle job, too. Yeah, yeah. So it's going to be IST, Matt KOF, against Kwamba Doju, Shao Hai. So oh, this is going to be so, so insane. Yesterday, Matt KOF was playing out of his mind. He was not Mad KOF, he was insane KOF. He was definitely living up to the name Mad KOF, showing, as usual, not a fan of blocking when he don't have to. That's why he plays Clark. Oh, it's so good. It's not good, Clark. Don't watch my but if any But if anybody here in the building, in the top six stage, is feeling comfortable, because I guarantee you they're all just clinching diamonds right now, it's Shao Hai, because he's already qualified for that final spot at the SWC Championships 2023, taking place next year in the springtime sometime. Yes, you're and completely right. The winner, or possibly, depending on what happens, the runner-up of this tournament Good. will be getting another spot there, yeah. and there will be more qualifier spots throughout the rest of the year. That's And that's a shout-out to the people behind that event shout out to that circuit we esports now we are keeping the kof legend alive make some noise for this dude that's yeah. the roar of the evil crowd no other crowd in the world look at these people look at these beautiful beautiful people come on love to see it man thank you friends and family for coming out to join us for evil 2023's kof 15 top six and we're just getting started and of course thank you everyone that it's at home also watching this, being part of this phenomenon, 17,000 strong. And this is going to climb up all day long because this is Evo, baby, the biggest Evo in history. And you are all part of this. We're just getting warmed up, baby. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Who gets first hit? Look at that team. That's an honest, the, an honest, true team of alpha males. You talking about kill? No, come on. Kale B, B, Janae, Cronin? Yeah, I agree. <laughs> no, that's the, the they, they definitely let you know who they are up front. Come on, let's see. Can Shao Hai defeat the Meta? He is the man against the Meta right now. Look at that team. We have Keys, we have Clark, we have Hydern, and he is trying to prove that he is the Meta. He is the one to establish the rhythm in this game. Oh, no, you're going to get some repukens for free? Okay, I, I take those. Does Geese disrupt the kill offense? Possibly. Definitely designed around not being able to just mash buttons on him. He does have three different counters that can cover all those. Whoa! He was very ready. Oh, what a punish right here. Geese does very good against these three characters, Pocket. Matt like, KOF being super aggressive with him, too. I think he knows that he has the advantage here because of Shao Hai. Not gun shy here, but also not really liking the looks he's getting. Oh, oh look at those. He said, don't even try it. Where are you going? Super Ooh. long A. And Matt KOF is beating. That close stand C is a menace. Matt KOF is beating the meta right now. Kyo broken? No, bro. The criminal is broken. The king of Southtown, bro. The most manly of men, that's for sure. 
Can he do something about the Buccaneers? Yeah, team? I don't know, man. That backdash area will be a forever present, always a threat. Oh, he didn't oh. even care. What a challenge from Salhai, though. He said, nah, too many frames in between. Big window. Never your turn. Never your turn against Vigenet. The carriers, I just say, but look at these going forward. And slapping Tried that girl out of the air. Tried it again that time. No jump CD for you. It was a, time, a timing change from Matt KOF, who is pushing forward. Let's see, trying to clip it. One, two, three, the kicks are on. Ooh, trying making to press him fly, investment. Trying to press his advantage, got end up getting clipped by the Harrier B, and that's just gonna lead to pure damage. And, and okay, we're gonna see it once more. Hmm. Oh, this, this guy is so beautiful, man. The toppest of the tiers, that's but for sure. Definitely, but that was still Mad KOF's point character. The Geese was in first. The Karks coming in, about to get three bars. That means every air-to-air -air gonna be EX tackle, possibly in a Gator roll, possibly in a DDT, possibly in a weird shovel slam thing he does. I don't know what name You are completely right, you see. Okay, a little instant overhead. Just keeping the run, and the Harriers, yes, this is the game now. This is why the meta is so strong. Oh, waking up with the throw. Clark, also a character that if you do the Harrier be a little too close, he can definitely punish him with ES grab. Won't even have to now. Is he going to blow it all? He's got to get max damage from this. From side to side, and we are going. He's going to turn her into a pretzel. Yeah, look at that. Mm, chiropractic Oh, check. God. Oh, 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 the humanity. Oh, the pain. People are waiting for it. Clean up all six. Who is arriving, Pockets? Who is arriving? We got Cronin coming in with three bars, almost three and a half. Still dangerous, can't just jump in, but still Clark with one bar. Air to air, gonna be EX tackle for sure. Money well spent on getting rid of that BCNA though. People losing their minds for Clark. Look at those hand tiers getting a little bit of extra resources. Oh, we tried to jump over Ooh, there. Oh, there's a lot of fire and slap. Are we going to invest? Yeah, we go. Not enough for the rifle steal. Oh, he bet everything on that. Matt KOF. Back at that. Shao Kai was so ready. Preventing. The head, but he worked with Hyder. Hyder on a top eight winner side, getting the scrub chops. This is project. This is definitely the uh, slow down sign here. Hyder gonna definitely change the pace of this match if Mad Kwan has his way here. Ooh, where are you going? He said you thought you could get away. You see the size of these arms. Ooh, he challenged it. Nice. Oh, the, the cross and Matt and Chow Hai is unable to confirm right there. Using the big hitbox. Oh, shoot! <laughs> he that fell ball. for it. He got him. Oh, One more is gonna do it. Oh, Oki Zeme? Nah, he's, that's too, that was too easy. Oh, need a layer three of that. Ooh, we almost had it. Oh, what a challenge over there. Chao Hai. Chao Hai with one bar. The Krona can't do a lot of damage, but it's still dangerous with almost two bars. The big boot is trying to press against the team. Really? Either. Activation of no. the neutral. What a block over there. He was more than ready. Mad Sh Caleb going a little too mad here. Might need to calm it down. Oh, the whip buddy, but he didn't have to confirm afterwards. And that might enough. be enough to do it. He got him in a corner. That's it. Yeah. So high round one. He got it. He got it. What a way to survive. The instincts of a hunter. Some will, some will say that's a thief. Oh. In games, El Ratero. Oh. But footsies. he's a king. He said, play footsies with me. Or my KOF. Footsies? He said, I don't want to play footsies with Cronin, no problem. We can do that. Look at that man. Compose myself. <laughs> One of the people who could be called a god in this, in this series, in this franchise, in this game. And the coolness. I like this concentration coming from Matt Kev. Look at that. Murder face. Yeah, he's back. <laughs> he's back from the Zen moment. And he is ready to deliver some pain. I feel like this guy has been seeing things quite differently than a lot of other players for some time, not only in season two, but in the season one. And we're seeing the culmination of all that hard work coming out, but he still has one hurdle. He has to close it out against Shao Hai, because right now he's doing such a good job of just limiting Shao Hai's best tools into kill, into Bijanae, and coming up roses going into the anchor round. It's just that last interaction oh. he has to command that. And oh boy, this is looking bad for Magte with Shao Hai on a tear. The offense doesn't end just there. You gotta hold all that frame advantage. Yeah, that super big CD. And now it's the turn of Matt KOF. Can he open up that kill? Patience from the Korean player, the Korean Titan. No, CD is for everyone. Big shoulder from Kyo Boregas. Big, big shoulder, and that's Treating possibly enough if he wants to keep it going. Yes, sir. Ooh, that's perfect. The last impact, scientific key, delivering that. As if this was math, if this was physics, Matt KOF now has to survive with his Clark. But what can he do? Mm, the, the, Clark was, the Clark was clutching against the Bijanet, and now Matt KOF, Matt KOF is hoping he can get through this kill with minimal damage and resources spent. Let's see. Play neutral, okay. Oh, he's not really able to confirm over there. A little bit of fast spaghetti here, but get out of here. Oh, the shutter strike, and here we go. 
We are gonna discipline this boy, this bad boy. Level mm. two, okay. Break hey. that back. Let him hear hey. him. Let him hear him. He's been hey. a bad, bad boy. Ooh. The great equalizer. Clark Steele is here, Bucket. Clark Steele with one bar. St Honestly, not a terrible situation. The air-to-air -air game is still scary against anybody because it leads to EX tackle. And as soon as he gets two bars, you probably get a solid hit and turn into a maximum combo. But at the same time, it's DJ Nate. Last time, Clark had hard a, to nail had a hard time, hard time against these DJ Nate. Again, command grabs do blow up a lot of moves that are kind of unsafe against command grabs, like uh, the B Harrier right there, man. I think Matt KOF is trying to save some cash, and save some money. He's got to get in range, though. He's got to get in Against the pirate, it's going to be so, so hard. It needs to be an instant overhead. Is he close enough? There it is! Oh, there it is! No. He can't just do that against Clark, especially in the corner. Oh, he was so ready. Matt KOF was waiting for that. But it's a, it's a, plus, pay to pri uh, a plus price to pay. No EX! Oh. Oh, no EX. He Why? wanted to hold the corner. I respect it. I respect it. He wanted to hold the corner. Ooh, challenge it. No overheads. No high lows. Empty jump. Let's see. Empty carrier yet again. He makes it in double con copia. The dough is over there with the empty carriers into the into the down. Now it's it's about Hydern. Can he deal with the, the, the discipline these two bad boys need? How is Hydern gonna handle this though? He's got some big normals here, but are they gonna be in the right place at the right time? And right now, no sir. Three bars on Bijanet's side. How does she build so much meter all the time? She's oh. never broke. The meta is too strong. Oh, finally the, the moon is coming out. Those blades in the arms of Hydern, they need oh, to charge. That's, oh, that's, that's gonna be, gonna be it. Shao Hai. It's gonna be too enough. Off. Look at that. Shao Hai. Such a convincing victory on that game number two. He's gonna move forward. He will face no other than E.T. And that's a rematch. Yeah, man. That's a rematch it's from a 2017. It's a classic. That is an Evo rematch classic right there, man. Woo! And now we will have to move into the loser's bracket. But before that pocket, we will have to take a little bit of a breath because, man, those matches, those matches were Simply insane. And you can see for yourself right here, man, this clutch play from Matt KOF's Clark decided to dump all the meter on it, turn into a pretzel, and get her out of the building in game one. Matt KOF was so close to take that game number one, and the momentum that Chao Hai built with Cronin was simply good enough to take him into game number two. What a way to start these top eight people! Are you not entertained? Yeah, they are. We're definitely entertained, but for now, Stay that emotion, and we'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. That sizzle? That's the soundtrack of Chipotle. The soundtrack of Chipotle? Oh, yeah. You come in, you're going to be hearing that sizzle. That's how you know that we always have fresh food. Fresh is what you stand for. <laughs> exactly. Registration for Capcom Pro Tour is now open. Over $2 million is on the line for the season with the first place prize of $1 million to the Capcom Cup 10 champion. Winners of the online and offline premiere events will also auto qualify for a spot at Capcom Cup 10. Open to all players in good standing, so check out CapcomProTour.com for scheduling and to find a qualifying tournament in your area. 
And we are back, el regreso, it's far from over. And we are here on the loser side of the bracket pocket. Now is the time where things really start feeling dangerous. As they say, Seeker Swim, definitely the model of the loser side of the bracket here. Mad KOF having a squeaker of a match with Shao Hai, but not enough to get him further in the winner side of the bracket. Going to go up against Weto Asamiya and Lasset. Barn burner with ET in the first game of the day. Going to face off against Son Sinwa Pamroshan Moku, who Not is a young man who's playing everybody here this weekend. If you want casuals, Moku's definitely your man right now. Yeah, man. What a player all the way from Japan trying to prove that the land of the rising sun has also a good legacy of KOF champs. He's fighting for the honor of his people, of his brother in arms. Very, very young as well, man. Just getting the career started out, and I have been impressed by him ever since I saw him start playing KOF 14. Uh, the dominance, the creativity, the uh, the solid, the, the solid gameplay, sticking to the game plan. He has all of those things in spades. He really just needs more tournament experience. I don't know. I feel like this guy could be the next big thing. You are completely right. I hope he can travel a little bit more, that he can go forth as a worldwide competitor because he has shown us so much. And of course, Lassif, we just saw him, uh, that team so strong, but of course, he will have to face He's also not very uh, unorthodox. Unorthodox, unorthodox uh, in by the closing, meta. <laughs> closing with uh, closing with Kukri, and of course with that with that long hook. Simply, it's a beautiful girl to see. Oh, and no launch post for you. The Harrier is here. That's why she's so good. Mm -hmm, man, it's really hard to. Oh, he just reversed on that. You have to kind of play Bijanet that way, where you're like, you know what? I know Harrier B is coming, and if I just block it, you're probably just going to disrespect me some more. So I have to give you something to think about. Right. Ooh, he oh, passed he it. went for it and changing it. That is the part. danger of challenging her jumps, because Harrier B also changes the trajectory of her of her jump. So if you try to anti air, she might just blow you up with a whip. Ah, Moke, Moke was so ready right Whoa. there. Oh, all the way over there. Caught the straight hurt. Okay. There. Okay, SNK, I see your Ooh. hitboxes. I extended her box there. They are, they are nice, of course. Pretty good. Pretty nice. Oh, the trade. Let's see, little by little, Mayday could be waking up, giving her a little bit of his own carrier kicks. Mm -hmm. I think that blew up her uh, anti air attack there. That was oh. interesting. That was a chance, but no catch. Blast is trying to maintain the oppression, to maintain the offensive right here. Both of them very humble in terms of, of, uh, of resources. Got a challenge Beat on it. the cross up. It got him in between the kicks. Ugh, so good. But the, but the tech and uh, maintaining the, the pressure. Okay, the big hitbox of the of the skirt is going to take it still. Very close first match Crazy between these two. Ivan. Oh, we, we change uh, Shermie's color. Interesting. Green color. Maybe that's a little bit better green. Uh, better, better luck, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Green is good luck. Trying to bring uh, some. Uh, Theory of color here, Lasset. And now with the anti air, that's going to be a completely full health journey. We are super even, even in terms of uh, bars, resources. What can Luong do? Big problem uh, incoming. Yeah, man. <laughs> Luong, fast, great, normal. Stan CD, that right there is a nightmare to deal with. Oh, uh, look at that. The opening out, unable to confirm right there. No, you're not going to be kicking me on the air, swatting that girl with the anti air. You thought you could jump back? I don't think so. Oh, oh. The pressure against the corner. Let's see. Unable to get out of there. Contra las cuerdas. Oh, what a challenge! I don't see. What a confirm! Oh my God! Beautiful compare right here by Mark. Oh, the grime! The grime! Everybody got opened up. Raise your hand if you got opened up. Yeah. Mm. Jump Cold. Oh man, I need some heart medicine after that one. Oh, that was a little bit of extra. That was extra sauce. Lassie trying to start something. No, but the cross up jet again. Ooh. Oh, the challenge here by Lassie. Running for her, not investing anything. Oh, oh yet again. Lassen will not be denied these throws, bro. He's just going oh. in. <laughs> the jump back with the kick. Great stuff over here. So close, man. This is a nail biter. And the ass coming in with almost five bars. This is the best ass round that Lassen has dealt with yet. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? This, this is, is gonna hurt. Oh, look at this. Oh, ah. Are we going to invest? Yes? No. They're staying in. Keeping it very humble. Next touch is gonna do it. And even not the not is gonna be sub 50 seconds. Not a lot of that life is gonna come back. Oh, oh the no! He got time! And he go forth! He wanted the reset! Trying to end it right there. That's a super! Oh, oh no. the dash under last it was so ready for it. But just with a sliver of health, he's able to survive. He has the resources. One touch. 
Can he bring the movie? Can he play? Can bro. he click, kick the button and show us La Danza Mortal? Bro, we're talking one hit activation territory right now. It's oh, oh, there we go! Oh, and a tap! We're gonna no! Why there? Why now? Why Ash? Oh man, that was perfect! That's what he needed. The money maker was right there. Oh! oh and he delivers the patience by Mock and he knows. No, 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 Lassie. You have to shake it. You have to forget about that mistake. That's in the past. I might have startled him. With my Focus dog. on I the bad, future. <laughs> Never show that kind of uh, vulnerability to your opponent. <laughs> you have to stay cool. You have. You have to stay as a calm stoic. and collected as a 23-year-old. Oh my God. Oh my God. He can do it. He's doing this for all Korea. We're back into it. That was so close. I think it lasted. Uh, outside of that error, uh, looking at closing out that match, I don't expect him to play this any differently. Maybe a little tighter there. Uh, it might be on Mok to actually make the adjustment here. Yeah, Mok has been playing so good. And the hardware kicks are going to Pushkin again in the corner. Look at the damage. Look at how much she can do. Oh, and getting open up, clipping the feet. The sleepy boy wants to wake up. She does it all, but baby. But Mok is not allowing that. Oh, what? <laughs> Psycho. The pillow is not working. The pressure is on. To make a move. Ooh. Great, finally. Getting the launch punch. Extra damage. I need the neutral. Again, the EX carrier kicks. They are so good. Fucking so good. Can't jump on B's and A. She can jump all she wants, but you are no jumping. She simply does it all. Lo hace todo. The last so I got to I, I gotta say, man, Lassen, if it's it, 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 it's hard not to be frustrated here. You know, uh, you got two and a half bars on the sermon, but every time you attempt to get something started, the BGNA is in the perfect place at the perfect time for her. Yeah, man, it's, look at this oppression against the corner of Oh my God, fashion. come you on! You cannot come press on. any button, and she will come from out of it. Of course, Moke, it's simply giving all his resources to keep uh, Shermy against it, and he's gonna challenge with the down two, with the two A. Oh my God, Moke. He's playing out of his mind right now. Yeah, I mean, the Mock is playing amazingly right now. Just every hair you're beating in the perfect place, every jump, every button, finding the mark, and Lassit just unable to find any aggressive footing. Nothing solid. Has to make something happen here. This is his last leg, literally. Most likely it will be. That was it. Can't Ash, hesitate there. Ash could do it, but he's such a high maintenance boy that even with those five bars, it's going to be so hard to take out three characters, and the Shatter Strike is going to get denied. I think the frustration is setting in, man. That, that Shatter Strike was definitely desperation. Okay, the slaps. Fire, green, fire, green fire slaps are not landing. Mokke playing with a fantastic patience right here, running out the clock, knowing that he has two full health characters, and everything that he does with this uh, big and this extra credit. Come. What a jump in, bro! Perfect. Changing it again. From that distance, the they jump in, low C, Jesus. It's such a beautiful girl, such a fantastic character. And Moke is using it as a craft. As a, as oh, a, as he, a, I couldn't even the empty jump. Oh my God. That's it. OCB for Moku. No, don't let it happen. Lassit, with a big smile on his face, a champion as always, going home with this uh, fifth place. What a man. I, I, I so, told you, he's a bad man. He's a bad man, that Moke. Make some noise for Lassit, people. Come on. Thank you, say goodbye to this for crowd, but Moke, what a boy, what a champ. This is this new, new blood on the scene, man, so good. And that kind of play style is really hard to nail down because you saw he had no fear about activating or executing any of those BGNA tools at any time. Uh, even if it was a situation where it might have been blocked and he might have been a little bit unsafe, it might have been a little precarious there, he just went and did it again, he just kept going in, and Lassit just didn't have an answer for it. Yeah, Logan man. Complete The way he was also confirming those uh, down Bs to those yeah. two Bs from so far. Yeah. Getting into it, each one of those openings was uh, making big money and you can't, yeah, to, to mock it. And when you're playing someone like Ash and you can't play at that range because you're already mm -hmm. getting pressured into like, what could be real damage? Oh. And Stifling. Really, a man on, and his craft, that task tool of his craft was, of course, that beautiful Buccaneer Queen, uh, Bignette La Pirata. But well, now we have to move forward. Another match, another international match, and now it's going to be all the way from Mexico.
de la pura ciudad, el güero Asamilla. Güero Asamilla. Absolutely fighting a war to get into the top six. He has the crowd on his side, of course. He will be fighting one of the strongest on the world and a Mexican slayer, to be, for, oh. <laughs> to be sure. <laughs> that is no other than Matt KOF. Your first KOF Evo champion. Man. There is no t-shirt now. <laughs> will that be... Would that be the difference? I'll be honest, I, the t-shirt, no t-shirt, I still got out of my pools and Matt KOF still got in top eight. <laughs> Let's go. What a Samilla playing uh, for Cinta Negra. He is really a, a, a player that has been doing so much work lately, getting top places on many international tournaments like Combo Breaker, like CEO, mm. and uh, also delivering great examples of skill in Mexico. Oh, another selfie, yes, here we go. Don't fall for it. No. He didn't even smile, he was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. get it over with. <laughs> bueno, look at him. Of course, Matt KOF, all geared up, as, as isolating himself from the public, look, uh, from the crowd, getting those headphones on. Mm -hmm. He knows uh, that he is on dangerous waters right here on this Evo stage. He's the focus, man. The roar mm -hmm. of the crowd can be somewhat distracting at times, but Weddle, Weddle lives through that. Yeah, he, he will feed from the chance of our brothers. So now we will see. Oh, no. Oh, forget, <laughs> forget about that. He will feed on the theme of the training stage for sure. <laughs> <laughs> but here we go. Weddle well, Samilla against Matt KOF, Korea, Korea against Mexico. Oh, this is going to be so exciting. I'm going to lose my mind, my boys right here. I'm telling you, I'm feeling the same way right now. And the, you know, Iori is in the building. Oh, it's going to be so hard. That team, I am so scared of that team. Geese, Clark, and Hydern. We've already seen how Matt Caleb handles the Geese kill matchup. So I think Will's going to show him something a little different here than what Shao Hai showed him. Or he can show him the same thing because Shao Hai ended up ripping him apart later on anyway. Let's see. In the moment of silence, here we go, the Crimson Kyo against uh, the wine looking keys. Oh, getting checked. Those, the, the vintage. It's so, so big hitboxes from that crime lord. Oh, Ooh, the blowback. No. Get up, boy. Uh, I got enough time to pick you up. You have to choke some plasma. Oh, don't touch me. Wake up, grab, get off. Jeez. I came in the pressure, let's see, where's Amiga? Oh, the corner. oh, he's gonna get it, and all the way around you are now caged against this lion. Try to hit him with the shoulder trap there. He gets out of there with a safe jump, not doing anything, and then with the grab, where's Amiga? But you know, those, that down A is so, so long. Man. Yeah, he's a character that definitely has a great down A, it's got good range on it pretty fast, so it's kind of, it might be a little more difficult than some other characters to do that shoulder trap than a lot of kills are used to. Where's Amiga tried to go for for some reason, the challenge strike, that's a big strategic victory for Matt KOF, making the Mexicans spend that bar. And uh, Villanet, the Buccaneer Queen, will be here with only one, now two bars. But okay, the carrier in a change timing, spending everything to get this out of the way. I like the cash out there. I do agree. Ooh, Ooh. I think that was super counter. Pressure, pressure, pressure. But Matt KOF resists is like a champ. He challenged it. I dig it. Oh, look at that anti-air. That anti-air A? B, sorry. <laughs> I, I get it. I take it. I take it. And Matt KOF being super smart and knowing it's the matchup. Running down the clock. He doesn't want the Pirate Queen to get any kind of a regeneration. She's still pretty healthy in that regard, though. Because going into the next round without much health still makes her fairly much in two-touch territory. Uh, especially uh, with oh. like Hart, who doesn't do a lot of damage Footsies. using meter. Perfect, Put perfect GMT. spacing over there. Now we have Clark. He has not the best of times against Vigenet, but of course we are talking about Matt KOF. Matt KOF proving that. Oh, oh no, he's gonna do it. He's not gonna kill, but that's gonna be a lot of damage. Oh yes, and it seems that everyone wants to bring some chiropractic adjustment. Like he has just saying, making her a pretzel. Oh, Look at God, that. Dude. Raw damage. Feel that in the morning. Oh, for sure. And for a complete Double week. <laughs> oh, no! He tried some tricky stuff, but Matt KOF was so ready. That might be the only downside of B Harrier, is that uh, you actually have to commit to that super slow fall, and the opponent can just run underneath you and uh, punish you. Now, let's see. With the most Mexican of yours this year, 
Can he do it? Oh, oh what a... Oh, that was fantastic! Ro having a perfect reaction here, Matt KOF. Wow, now he got the opening. Oh, baby! This is gonna be big damage. No, 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 he wants the setup. Okay, let's see. He wants that level 2 fireworks, I guarantee. Ooh, the delay records! Burning the face. This is all oh, the nature. He has the, the command grab. And we're gonna see the sparks. This is going to be it. Trying to go for the taquito. No, he went trying to, 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 to read a backdash oh, from Matt And this man. is gonna be terrible for El Güero. Good damage for Clark coming up, putting him back center screen. Yeah, getting a little bit of resources again. Those, those forward dashes. Oh, that's it. Oh, that was a jump heavy punch. That probably would have been it. Oh. Long range nails. 25 seconds on the clock. Oh, Mateo boy. Has. He's gonna take this with Clark. Frank Two. Ken Steiner. Three. My God. Had to, had to hit him with the head. Yeah, man. He would raise your hands uh, for that Clark. Matt KOF looking like a complete monster right here. My heart is breaking where a Samilla can bring it back. I know it. But of course, the Titan in front, the Titan to beat, is a complete monster, my dear Hell Pocket. Weddle has got a bracket full of like challenge impossible. Uh, players in this bracket right now. So, uh, getting anywhere here is a tremendous victory for anybody. Uh, but once again, Matt Taylor proving to the world why he was an evil champion, why he is an evil champion. And Matt probably it could be another one. Matt Taylor believed for a moment in El Guero Samiga going for the predictable. And the bodegas are here delivering to the people what they deserve. Oh, yeah! He is providing right now. Great blocks over here by Matt Kerev. Yet again, that defense from, from the Korean yeah. Titan. That it's so cooking, good. Man. That show is cooking, but that jump CD hit. Skip neutral. He's just suspending everything. That jump D super fast. Good way to interrupt a lot of uh, air to air like situations like that. Fire D, no meter for activation. No, oh, that it. That was so far. Doesn't need it. Orochinagi, and now that Kyo has waken up. Get him out of here. Asamiya. It's looking strong. Now let's see if he can climb this wall. Any air to air is going to be so painful. But oh, Ooh. goes for the common grab. He's completely naked. Está encuerado. No resources, but he's going to play this combo. He's going to play this like you are in El Barrio. Great placement on all these options from Wero right now. Great timing as well. Right in the needle in a lot of these situations. Oh, he's really bringing the war into Matteo F. Big, big knuckles over there. The turn punch. And Wero using the CD. He has the corner. Oh! That was a very oh, good situation, no. and now he's gonna get points for that. But how much will Matt KOF invest? I think he saw, he might have thought he saw a button coming out there. Mm. Oh, oh, no, the classic. Here. The classic. Open the arms. Oh. Oh. Nonetheless, sub 30 Rico. going into the secondary battle here. Weddle Asamiya is still up a, char a half a character, basically. Yeah, and he has two bars to work now. Let's see, last time uh, he got uh, Big Janet, La Pirata got completely cancelled, and uh, mm. it's looking like that yet again. Mm. Breaking the neck. What? From that distance, he must have stuck something out. He knows something, Buckets. He knows something, Play, playing that perfect spacing. Somebody clip that in the chat, I want to see that later on. <laughs> We're going to bring that topic to SNK, but now the one who is bringing the pain is Matt Kev, where well, Samilla finally able to get something moving, but no, Matt Kev says it's not your turn, it's mine. Oh, where are you going? Oh, oh. You're back into the corner, you're down. You cannot sit on your hands against this Clark, bro. You cannot play passive. Bijanet not being a factor for the Mexican player. Now he's in this exact same scenario that last time with Yori, three bars. That's a lot of salsa, but can, can uh, the Korean player let the Mexican cook? <laughs> I think Weddle's gonna have to get way more aggressive than this right now. He's doing a little bit too much passive play backing up. There we go. We want to see those trades. What an ant here. Oh, we had it. Oh, the see. down C, old reliable. Being very careful right here with Asamilla. Clipping, uh, clipping toes, but no confirming yet yeah, again. That's another one, man. He didn't like the distance on it, I guess. And the roll. Matt KOF didn't want it to deal with the Taconcito. Oh, this is, this is definitely some uh, high-level high pressure going on here yeah. right now, man. You definitely have to watch this one closely. Oh, oh the tech grab! That's the range that where Samir was trying to avoid. And of course, Matt Kev is going to invest big here. He 
has the position in Iowa. I, I was so worried for the Argentina right back here after that jump. We're sub, mm. we're sub 30 here, man. Almost sub 20, man. Melo Asami has to make something happen here. He is not going to win on a timeout, and he's darn sure not going to win. At oh. Being his last character on his last game, he has to make something happen right now. Still trying to open up. Oh, oh there it is, is baby! Come on, grab your. I can do it too. And we are going to spend the meter in order to pass above Clark. He's going to take it. Oh, What's he got for the Hyder? No, he's gonna have 40 percent tops. The Hyder's got 30 percent. An my easy God. job here. What? Oh, oh, where he's trying to bring the war into this military mind mastermind. Be careful there. Oh, oh. He's, and now Mad KOF caught on his heels, getting gripped all over the place. El Yori es el que lo puede hacer. El Yori loco. Oh, he got he caught again. Ciudad, el del barrio. Has to make it all count. Has to make it all count. Ah! No way! Widow! Oh, one more test is gonna do it! One more test! Oh, oh. good job! No way! The job CD! No good! What the projectile? The close it out! Lo está logrando! Con un sueño! El Guerrero Azteca, he's surviving, he's moving forward! And the, the complete crowd is giving it to him! Holy crap! Oh! What a moment to be alive! Cinta Negra, Güero Asamilla! Wow, he got in his brain, bro. I told you, El, El Yori Mas Mexicano, the most Mexican of Yori this year, is proving that, yes, Yori Yagami is Mexican. All right, well, Mad KOF got to calm it down a little bit there, because I think we saw a little bit of, little bit of uh, cracks no. in the armor. The game plan might have fell apart a little bit there, and Mad KOF with a big adjustment here already. Wedo Asamiya also got to calm down. Yeah, man. After that, the hands for sure are shaking. The heart is beating. Oh. The man hesitates, but he's gonna keep the, the, the kick. And now a good positioning. What are you going to do? The pressure is on. Is the train, it is the train coming into station here? Because we know what happens when Kyo gets one confirmed knockdown. Ooh. And he's in the corner too. Are we seeing coast to coast Kyo pressure? Yeah. Matt left with that defense, but look at the bar. Some more pressure. Oh, he's oh, gonna get it. We tried the back dash. Patience now. And just like that. What a roll, but where match. are you going? Where are you going? He is so calmly. La rodillita. And he's going to steal another game, another character. Where are you going? How you feeling, Colt? Oh, I'm feeling, I'm feeling my, in my heart. I'm feeling it in my chest, bursting out of pride. Tingling. But my KOF will always be a menace. And this Clark has been such a nightmare for Guero. Mm. Let's see. Still up a character here. He says he cannot jump. With that counter hit, oh, he had to pick up. Oh, he there. went for the command grab, but Kios came out first, grabbing the command grabber. Oh, that's gonna be big. Oh, in the corner too. Hey, he's gonna have to chip forward. Let's see. Oh, unfortunate oh, drop turns the into Mexican. a reset situation. The most what is going on here? Oh my oh. God! And that was that has to be on purpose. That has to be from the most Mexican of resets. <laughs> oh God! And, and Guero Asamiya absolutely emotionless in the face of that sequence. And for sure you know that Matt Kiyoff is going to be thinking about that. Give me that tail. Oh, dude. Three bars for Hyder right now. Still alive. <laughs> oh. Right, and right now, Guero Asamiya is playing with so much house money, he can let it ride. Oh! And the end is going to be Hyder who, who takes the execution. But that Kiyo, Kiyo Kusanagi proving to be so worthy for Guero Asamiya. And just now getting to the Bijan man. Like if Mad Caleb has a trick in the hat with the hider, he needs to pull it out pronto. Yeah, because we saw how much trouble Guero had against Clark with this Bijan but finally she has the chance to shine on this Evo, Evo stage. Let's see, there we go. Yeah, give me the keys, baby. The oh, I love you. Oh, okay, okay. All right, what else? I'm gonna put the corner here, but still life lead in his favor. And so good and still a character. But don't get greedy. Because there is a lot of money on Matt KOF's pocket. And you know what kind of can do. Oh, no, the cross-up hasn't really been able to respond correctly to that cross-up situation yet. Oh, wow. so from he swung all the way over there. A Hail Mary. Swung at that. You madman. Oh, oh, shatter strike! He's got plenty of cash to spend here. Matt too. KOF is no way oh, out of this. Oh no, so man. close. You left her alive. Is that gonna be have to chip out there? Yeah, we yeah, don't yeah. even need to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Checkmate over there. Che checking the queen. He's but Matt KOF. He's heating up, Colt. It's so dangerous. How many times we have seen him like this? 
But now he's Yori. It's a one touch situation. Oh, jump into grass. It's a one touch situation. Oh, oh it's the over. Contract it's over. Bueno Asamiya is going to advance in the loser's side of top six here in Evo 2023 over Red KOF. He's going to win. He's going to break the curse. He's going to break the curse. Oh, my Lord. Oh. Si fue la playera. Oh, it was oh. the t shirt. No, of course not. <laughs> but, but my God. <laughs> my God, what a champion. Make some noise for Matt KOF. Please, a brother in arms. Matt Kale oh. definitely did the damn thing here this weekend. And we'll see him again, I'm sure, man. He's definitely going to be a big problem for everybody playing KO 15 in the world. But Wedo Asamiya punched his ticket to another game in the loser side of top six. Such a heartbreaker, man. Both Korean champions are going home at this same step. Mexico is going to position itself on the best four countries of the world. In KOF, la tradición se salva. But him, of man. course, someone's got to lose. Yeah, sadly, we have to see both Matt KOF and Lassit go home. But who are, who is not going home and anywhere is us. It's <laughs> us. You guys stay here. We have to take a break after that. We'll be right back. Your Chipotle order just got extra with fighter coins from Street Fighter 6. Order any entree in the Chipotle app using promo code HDKN236 and receive 250 fighter coins with your order. Visit chipotle.com slash SF6 for details. Red Bull gives you wings.
What's up, everybody? And welcome back to Evo Connections, presented by at and I'm Persia, and I am joined by Supa M in this Supa Crispy Leroy cosplay. Hey. And we got Sugar, too. You can't leave Sugar out. Leave. What is the importance to you to connect with the characters that you cosplay as? Oh, absolutely. It's incredibly important. When Leroy Smith came out, I really felt like this is me. And it came out in a very tumultuous time in America and the community received it. I actually cosplay only characters that I play in games. So to be able to play a character that represents me, I absolutely had to do this character. This was a special build. Um, everything that you see here was hand designed. Every inch of the dragons were completely redesigned from the ground up. Sugar actually took a whole week by herself. I sat there in my kitchen with a cotton ball and dabbed every bit of detail that you see on her right now. So this is the one and only sugar that is out there. Love to hear it. And honestly, I think at this point, Evo truly isn't complete without all of our amazing cosplayers. Absolutely. Are there any other cosplayers you've connected with or you know met for the first time? I, well, met for the first time, I met a ton. We had a cosplay competition this year, the first time for Evo. And the original inspiration for this costume was because of my locals. It was just the local tournament, they said, we really need some publicity. Would you mind doing a cosplay? And I love those guys. And I really feel like we should all really be supporting our grassroots in the FGC and supporting our local. So shout out to 404 Esports. You guys are the ones who made this happen. Shout out to Greg Lancet. He's the one who put all of this together. And shout out to the community out there. I'm doing this all for you guys. You already know, trying to win this first place cosplay competition. And just go out and support your locals, guys. Amazing, exactly. Support your locals, don't forget it. I hope you've all been enjoying the show. Thank you so much for joining us and we're gonna send it right on back to the main stage. Hey, we're back with more KO15 top eight, top six action, excuse me, yes. here at Evo 2023. <laughs> oh man, it has been one hell of an afternoon already and I feel like, we, how many matches do we have left? It feels like way too many to count. Yeah, man. This is the story as we have lived it, that we all will remember it. Uh, E.T. beating Lassie, then the Mad KOF falling against Shanghai. Mad KOF who was eliminated by Guero Asamilla, and of course, Lassie who was taken home by Moke from Japan. Now we move forward. We move to the most privileged of spots in a tournament. We move to the winner's side of the bracket. The winner's finals, finals to mm. be exact here, and it's up. It's going to be against, or it's going to feature, excuse me. Oh man, I can hardly speak. This is a Evo legendary Champs. rematch here. This is Evo 2017, Kayla 14 Grand Finals, the run back here. And it could happen again, you never know. These guys have been banging it up with each other for years in two, both KOF games, all KOF games. It could only come down to this. Two players that have a very strong statement on being the best KOF player in history are right here facing each other, absolute specialists of the KOF franchise, and of course, some of the most dangerous players in the world. This is the FGC, the cream of the crop of the FGC, right here on the EVO stage. Damn pockets. Can you feel it in the air? It's electric. My breath is short, bro. I can hardly hold it all in. Oh, here we go. Here we go, anyone will kill to see these kind of finals, and we have it here on EVO 2023. Let's go, make some noise! There you go, man. Oh, the whole beat out the gate. That Isla, man, an argument that a lot of Islas will be coming now that she is proven to be one of the best characters in the game. Yeah, and he's he one of those players who have come close to stopping this train that is Shao Hai's dominance in Kayla 15 so far. Just not able to seal the deal enough times uh, to make it count. But this could be the turnaround here. Okay, let's see. We can heal all these people. And of course, Shao Hai trying to prove he has the best of them. Oh, moving forward, but the challenge from ET trying to stay away from there. No, you're not going anywhere. The, 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 the C, the B, sorry, is going to get, keep him in place. No, no need. And the CD to keep the pressure on the command grab. That's so dirty. Yeah, that's what happens you get a little too passive against the kill in the corner. He always has that option available. Oh. Just catching for just blocking too much. That's so good right there, Shao Hai. Proving, taking these a little bit extra further. A little bit more of salsa right here from Shanghai. But Vijanet is here. And what a confirm over here for me to to make that happen a couple more times. He wants to Ooh, what, what? Oh, he couldn't have meant to do that. Okay, great. Facing up there. We're going to see it again? Yes. Yes. It, it, it's always investing like that. He's, he believes in, uh, in capitalism. He, <laughs> he invests 
when he sees these kind of situations and always makes the most out of oh, it. Oh, cross up! Oh, no, this cow is about to get away with so much house money. Talking about investments. Oh, yeah, W Orochinagi oh, for your more. troubles. Ooh, I love it. Always love to see double Orochinagi, yeah. Thought that was gonna be a scoop up there for a second. Yeah. So close, so close. No, no winds of change. Right now, E.T. in a lot of trouble here on a second character. Almost gone into his anchor. This isn't gonna get rid of him. No! Not gonna get rid of Rico. Oh, okay, there we go. What a great check. Swing. Perfect spacing over there, not giving any kind of risk. Nonetheless, can you go damage against? done. Yeah, man, look at that health. 20% only. Oh, but he's gonna open it up. Very, very strongly. One, two, three. The set of the sun. So that's two bars. Block. So that's two bars here. You can do a lot of damage with another touch. Oh, Ooh, he swung at it. He didn't. He wants to kill with those bars. He wants the resources. He wants the menace to be here. What a, what a comeback from ET. He's Yo, what a good bar. What a pick up off the counter. He's gonna oh. take with the last investment. What a, what a way to turn things around. ET finally making the winds of change blow in the, in the. Uh, in the direction of his own vision. That counter hit was everything, man. That's the kind of play you played at the top level KOS. That's grown and it's gone. And we are going to see the most 15 match of them all. Esto es la quince más pura. Cronen against Cronen. Who has the, the strongest ladron and right here, Pockets? Mm, I don't know, man. This could be anyone's game. It really depends on the decision making here. This is real good footsies. Uh, happens up your right. This is going to be a lot of damage. Deactivated off of that. Yeah. No enough to uh, go for the gun. How are you? Trying to go for the grid. This is going to be it. going to be it, man. He's got another bar to spin. Oh, here we go. Shao High with such a dominant display. Look at the bling bling, bro. Oh, not a smudge on it. 24 karat gold. Remind everybody, this is a three out of five set since this is winner's final. So two more chances for ET to turn this around. But man, what a dominant anchor round from Shao Hai there. The truth is that uh, Shao Hai has to, do, to bring the box because if not, the, the spotlight would reflect on the eyes of his <laughs> opponents. Like, he's taking care of his opponents, in fact. It, actually, that's a good point. <laughs> no, no dirty advantage. The glare on that stick might be blinding. Let's go. We are going to see this. <clears throat> as the concentration, look at, he, he looks so fresh, man. He looks as if nothing is happening. He's, he's playing at the living room on his house. Yeah, no, he's just chilling. Ready? Yeah, this is, his, this is his environment. ET right now just has to find a way to get Shao Hai uncomfortable. Very hot, tall task, indeed. Trying to start some rhythm right here. What can, can do the flash kick to get out of there? And some pain for your trouble. Or is that body, uh, body spray, maybe? Oh, nice. Oh, he had that real quick. Didn't want to confirm. Didn't want to confirm. One, two. Mm. Yeah. Into the kick for the corner carry. The pressure is on. He has turned by main cast investment. Over here by ET. I think ET is noticing that Shao Hai is taking a little too much, uh, making a little too, too many liberal jumps in that. Up. So he's probably going to try to work the anti air angle a little bit more. Or well, maybe Shao Hai might back off it now that he did take a DP for his trouble. Look at the patience right here. ET using all of that mobility from Isla. He doesn't want to be close to, to Kyo. And Shao Hai, of course, Ooh. wants to make this uh, ombligo for ombligo. He wants to so jump again. No, 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 where are you going? He wants another jump. There. Oh, the low B! But not enough to kill. So very close. Oh, oh, going for the EX body. <laughs> One in doubt, great class. Yeah, man. So much uh, privilege right there with the armor and everything. But the damage is done. Vigenet only needs one simple confirm, and it will be over. We will have an even game. Oh, there it is. Only half a bar needed. Shao Hai will be coming with three complete bars. Can ET turn this momentum around, though? Because Shao Hai still up three characters. It's a mirror match. Or three bars, up three bars. It's a mirror match, and it didn't go so well. Uh, for ET last time. I think the pivotal moment could be occurring here. To be honest, he, was, he had the momentum in the last time, and Vision and Trust, the character, could beat it for him. So let's see, because right now, Shao Hai is completely on the offensive, not allowing DT to have any what? kind of turn. What a challenge! Oh, he said, no, you cannot get there for free! It's oh. not a safe jump, brother! Then give me a little out of love. We are going to have the pressure over here. Who is going to win the turn? Oh, the big mistake, but these are a little bit far away from the reach of that of that C. Oh, what a wake up. Oh, yeah, pressing nice. the bottom. Good. No, yeah, nice. we're no, going to no. see it. No way she's got that damage. La no Chancla. I'm not, I'm not even going to say it. Don't, I'm not even guessing. He's going to punish with La Chancla, the no most way. feared of weapons. Yeah. Oh, 
Get out of here. She's so beautiful. Don't Junk her. Oh. She's so beautiful, man. Oh, my God, dude. What a way to confirm. What are, what's in those shoes, bro? You want to capitalize. You call Chao Hai. <laughs> oh. That's basic. Right, yeah. Not going to be enough to kill yet, but I like the damage nonetheless. He has to make it happen quick, though. It's going to be very close if he kills uh, faster. Oh, oh, and of course, Chao Hai is not going to allow that to happen. One, two. Mm -hmm. Bring it the wins. The D out. Oh, oh, he just challenged it! She's all just so good at that! Yeah, all of this is so much of extra, extra money. This is all each time Shao Hai makes a hit it's so big! Stomped on her, standing. Man, Shao Hai right now just letting the clock run. DT on his last character on life support. Oh, it's going so bad. Might be able to do it here. DT, the cheap damage. Oh, oh he wanted, he's it, he wanted it. it. Yeah, he fell to his bones. Gets out of there. And it's going to be Shao Hai who gets game in number two. Shao Hai continues to gain, gain ground in this matchup. Uh, didn't even get to the Cronin this time on his side. Of course, we are on finals. So that's why we are going into game number three. You have another chance, but imagine turning this around against Shao Hai. It's uh, so, so hard, man. Yeah, I mean, there's there's definitely something to be said about uh, how people play fighting games, how people play KOF, and then how Shao Hai plays KOF. And it's like the complete antithesis to a lot of good players' game plan. Let's see, one more chance. Isla was uh, popping up lately. Like, that, that has to match. Uh, she was doing so good, and that momentum is keeping on. So this is maybe what, she, what it needs. He's Isla dominating his first match. No cancel. Oh, there's a big one. Oh, that's going to be. No, no. He was unable to build the bar time, in time. But now he's going to use it. And this that's is gonna be, This is the, what he needed. This, yeah. is the, this is what he needed. This is the momentum shift. Wow, I did not see that round coming from E.T. at this point. But he needed it when he needed it. Ready? Let's, can he do the same thing for the Beast Nade, though? Starting out pretty strong with that down C. Whoa! Like, that jumping A can challenge many things from from Jen. That's for sure. Let's see the Pirate Queens going forward. The beautiful Jenny is now having Isla, the Chilean girl, against the corner, but she fights her way out. Fantastic stop, stop over here by E.T. These far reaching buttons are gonna give Beast Nade a hard time. Clearly she can't swing from that distance, but Isla can! Let's see. Ooh, great. Uh, the, the two characters with fantastic air mobility. So many options when they are uh, away from, uh, from the ground. Mm -hmm. Oh! Ooh, just like that. There. Unable to open her up to steal. Oh, he got hit by that! This is gonna hurt. This Super. is gonna... Oh, oh, no. He decided to go for free. That's okay. Get the trade either. And I'm still gonna, up on his point character. This is what she... That, that we need some Pisco. Some Pisco from Chile. It's what E.T. needed with Isla. And he is... Moving forward against uh, the Ladrones. Oh, that was a uh, stinky DD. With four bars, it's like could be dead in one touch. Okay, it's gonna be two touch. Mm. And I think right now, yeah, ET uh, showing Shao Hai a hard time. Uh, out with those good ones, and that's it. finally got her out of there. Uh, had to spend two bars on it, though. <coughs> I guarantee you, ET does not feel too bad about that. No, completely not. That's a hard worker girl for sure. She's making the difference right now. And even the Weaver ET, the, uh, 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 the resources advantage that he's using right here in the perfect way. No OTG. Might get the pressure. One, two. Mm -hmm. Keeping the check. It's quite a tremendous adjustment here on ET's part. Yeah, he's making uh, Shao Kai make the mistake. And he's punishing hard for that. Oh, he wanted the instant overhand. He said, take this with you. Whoa, that delay hit. Oh, this is bringing me back to last year, Pocket. It was so similar he's to that him, situation. Him, and the karma is back. That's going to be enough with two characters. E.T. fights back. Yeah. We're going into game four. Oh, more high quality cough. KOF from everyone. Look at this crowd. Look at La Familia. Brothers by KOF. Maybe not by blood, but yes, by passion. Ooh. Oh, my friend, dude. This is what it's all about. It's so close, man. What a way to come back with Isla. He, uh, that's 
the uh, the, fin uh, the Carter who is making the difference. In oh, we're going for a mirror match. Oh, really? Now remember, uh, Shao I definitely sung the praises of Isla at the earliest times of Cable 15's inception before release. Uh, so he has some experience with her, obviously. I'm not it's saying that uh, he's a slouch in comparison to ETs. But this is, as far as I can tell, in recent months, unprecedented from what I've seen. Oh my god, you're going straight into the character select, picking the character that is giving him the troubles. That's a big adjustment by no other than Wamba, though you shall hide. And I gotta say, I think he just, he just must not like the Isla Bijan in that trip. He probably didn't feel too wild about the kill beat the Isla matchup either, but would rather take his chances with that. And it may but or may not pay off here. The question is, was Bijan really the trouble? The problem? Uh, I guess the Isla. I don't know. I think well, I, this, this is the decision of the pro. No, I mean, uh, switching, switching, uh, switch it out Bijan for Bijan I agree. Yeah. I agree. But we don't know. We never know. We don't know what's going on in Shao He may have a completely different view of this than we do. And right now, the kill pick, let's stay on point, is working out for him. Oh my god. So he was not killed. The problem was not killed. That's for sure. Yeah, he was feeling fine about the kill match up there. And now, uh, the, the solution from the equation name as E.T. has the name of Kyo Kusanagi. Oh, that's <laughs> long range. Ooh. Long range A, and now we're going for the old classics. Trying to get for the knee. And taking everything in control, both the Harriers are in time. Oh, one, two. This is going to push her all the way to the corner. You can literally see Shao Hai's comfort levels rising as he got rid of the Gisela. Now, E.T. with Bijanet. Jenny has to do a lot of work, wow. but the challenge is perfect right there by Shao Hai, who wants to play this slow game, who wants to push forward, and look at it, oh no, you will have to come to me, and finally he says, okay, I'm coming, open up. Not gonna spend a minute to get rid of him, wants to save him for this next round, be very even gets a chance, oh, that's a punish. That's a lap, bye bye. Oh, you, you were afraid of something. Now question is here, can, can Shao Hai make Use Isla. of the Isla against mm -hmm. the Bijan matchup when ET might already know a little bit more about that situation than he does. Is the Pisco from Shanghai as good as the one from ET? That's the, that's the question. Bye bye, the grab. That's a good question. Pushing the fourth. Little by little, Shanghai is getting into the corner. ET pressuring. Uh -oh. oh, what a pickup! Oh, fantastic confirm over here. And we are going to see investment? No, we are going to stay on the pressure. Empty jump into grab, that's oh, sick. Las man. Cochinas. I don't know if Shao Hai had the juice like that. I think E.T. was like, yeah, I want you to pick this matchup because I know exactly what I'm supposed to do with this situation. Uh, four bars. That's going to be big for Shao Hai. One impact could be the end of Jenny. Oh, baby. Oh, get out of there. Out of the air. Arachi. Oh, that confirmed from the far C. Mm, that's it. Isla not looking as refined as the one from ET, but still able to do the job. That heavy punch is all you need, baby. Oh, look at them. So focused. Groaning, four bars. It's gonna be so close. The drill is not hitting. Oh, wow. that's, that's a gift. That's a gift, and Chao Hai is taking them. Mm. Hard knock down. Go rolls out of the corner. I like it, Gat. A That's chance it. here. We're gonna see the, the most KOF 15 match now. Only one bar. Cronin against Cronin. Chao Hai will have basically three. Three bars of butter, three bottles of salsa. We're still looking at a very cook. similar situation between both players here, though. Two, three touches possible. Oh. All right, yeah. Maintaining the pressure, okay. Oh, activation! He's gonna, he's gonna be so big, but he not, of course not able to kill. Still, he has the momentum. Can he? Can he keep it with the, with all this? From, oh, what a challenge over there. He saw it, he felt it. I thought a DP was coming for sure. This might be it, this might be it. It's enough, oh, it's that's enough. that's enough, that's enough. Oh, no, 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 I'm a liar. He's still in it, blocks the low C. Oh, he's alive. Oh, he's too close, too far away, too far away. He's alive, I'm going for it, he has a turn. He has also one bar. Oh my oh, god, no, I mean, right there's a minute too far away, it's too far away. Ah, ah, not, ah, not like that. Even Chao Hai knows. He knows the EX didn't came out, and the big mistake from ET is going to set Shao Hai into the grand finals on the winner's side. Please celebrate these Warriors, make some noise! What a display! Tragedy! Tragedy indeed, man. I feel like shades of last year's grand finals against CJZ. Yes. Just the erroneous input.
just as if it was written by the Greeks, by the classics. This is a show of glory and tragedy at the evil stage. My God, you have to be here. And you are, if you are watching from home, thank you very much. And the people here are living it. Make noise, feel it, siéntanlo! Oh you, God! Everybody's feeling it right now because we have got the battle of battles coming up right now. Oh, here he is. You can you can listen from the crowd. The chant is about Mexico because Guerra Samilla is gonna take onto the stage and he's going to find to uh, to fight. Sorry, Moke, all the way from Japan, the land of the rising sun. It's going to be. A killer match. Both players with a ton of momentum on their sides right now, making yes. out of the loser side the match uh, with legendary ramifications oh. both times. This is also very important for the worldwide KOF scene because if Guero Samilla is able to do this, he will place the American KOF, the all of American KOF, as part of the best three countries in the world, as part of that elite that we have been seeing dominate for the last years in this game. Mm -hmm. So this is so very important. Can Guero Samilla push all of the American people, todos los Latinos, even our North American brothers, oh, uh, into that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're fighting for a continent now. All right. All of America being represented by what man? There's the Mexico, and look at that. He's got all of PNS on his back. Yeah, <laughs> the samurai right there. This is Shingwa promotion, Moke. And of course, de la pura ciudad, uh, Cinta Negra, Güero Asamilla. Oh, God. Oh, man, this is peak theater, if you ask me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shakespeare, Bubasai. Mm. Why do I ever thought about doing movies, man? He's definitely got a face for like camera. Yeah, maybe if as a, I don't know if movies, but as a telenovela villain, he would be perfect for that. Yeah, definitely. And everyone, I, I don't know if they are there in the in the crowd, uh, but people of Mexico were brought uh, some some weird faces. I saw that, and I was like, how did they just have those ready to go? <laughs> no, they, that's that's what we like to know, faith. They knew. They knew it was happening. They knew he was Dang. happening. Dang. They That's knew cool. where it was happening. That's sick. And there's the chance right there. Reto ready to take on fellow champion here, Mulk. Remember, this is two out of three. This is losers semifinals. So it's going to be incredibly dangerous. Of course, Mulk is going to start with Vigineta. Very interesting. That uh, Wero is starting with the Yori, the character that helped him rob so many others during this tournament. Yeah, I've been seeing him put the Yori in the back for the longest of recent season two. But uh, maybe he likes this particular matchup a little better. Oh, that was so close. Or he just wants to be in to be in the back. El Taconcito almost hit, but Moke was more than ready. Oh, the show we had it. The big, the big. Yet he's making the cancels now, but unable to confirm. A little bit of yes, he can punish that from that distance, man. That far A is tremendous. Ooh, oh, oh, that's dirty. Open him up. Very, very strong start over here by Mock. The young man is proving to be a killer. Where the kill coming in against the almost full health Dijon Breaks the throat. Oh, man. Blows up the 3D. Got to eat all this damage and take the corner. You get grabbed on your way. Jesus. Vigenet dominating two full years of evil and still doing it here. She says, no, don't touch me, criminal. Oh, no, I don't bro. care. Nah, you can't be at the skip neutral button, man. What's going on here? I don't care. The carriers are just that good. And he's going to do a perfect card cancel in order to punish. Look at that. Mock com in a complete rundown. He's steam rolling. Where was Amiya right now? Mm. Ooh, all right, not getting a lot of, not gonna get a lot of damage here, but he needs that just to get something going here on offense. All right, the train's starting to pull out the station. The pressure is on. Oh, what a, what a big shoulder. Yeah, she's actually got a pretty good jump CD also. Oh, carriers all day long. They are providing, they are providing Japan with such a good path. And in the mirror match, can Wero Samilla own to be Janet? Make the difference. All hill to climb here. He's got to get rid of the Bijan the long, and then the Kugri. Oof. Oh, what? The, that was a great cross up. But Wero says, I can open him up again. I'm not oh. going to do that. Oh, that's terrible. Wero is feeling the nerves. The Kyle's son shaking pockets. Uh, oh, man. 
That's some hard offense to deal with. Ah. He wanted to hold on to that meter, possibly might be able to do this for less than two bars. Oh, what a cross up! That was insane from so high up. Oh. And he was able to confirm. Mock is working on an OCB to welcome Guerra Samilla to that to this top four. And he's gonna get it! Damn! OCV, man, this is two out of three, so one more chance for whether to turn around, but what a dominant normally performance people, from Normally Mox. people say that Japanese uh, nationals are super respectful, <laughs> but there is no respect coming from Moke. He is just going forward and forward and forward. But of course, we saw this situation before. Cueguero Asamilla was losing against, uh, against Matt KOF, and he was able to turn it around, so there is still hope for the Mexican warrior. Actually, he's being very respectful. He's pointing out to Weddle, like, hey, you got an opening there, you got an opening there, you got an opening there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just want to let you know you're open. Yes, yes. A little bit of a, of a beating right here. But Pockets, this is the moment of truth. Mirror match yet again. He felt comfortable. And the order was his change. The, the chess game of KOF is being played. Weddle putting the Dijonet on point this time. Once the mirror match might be able to turn everything around and Malka say, yeah, bring it on, bro. Oh, esta morenita, this B Jenny, this Jenny, perfectly tanned, is really making a show right here, finally. Weddle's amiga is able to start something, but the difference in health is significant. Yeah, man, Malka started so fast. Reaching with the slap. Weddle, right. And I'll say Weddle's not a, a stranger from playing from behind, though. He's definitely been able to shift the momentum in previous matches. So not out of it yet, but Moki not taking his foot off the gas here. Hard to deal with. Wow. What? On the same side and crossing over to how, punish. How high was she when she hit that? Mok looked like he knows every single pixel of those hitboxes. That's for sure. And he's looking so strong. Whereas Amiya was only able to deliver 10% damage. Oh, but the command grab is gonna be here. Burning that beautiful face. And on the corner, can he do something? Can he, can he change the future? What a cut Perfect guard cancel over there. Mock is playing so refined. He looks in a, in a fantastic moment right now, Kelpak. Yeah, he is so sharp right now. Almost unstoppable by the looks of it. Weddle having such a hard time just getting him to commit to anything that might spell doom for him. This might be, we might be the end of the BCNA. No, he holds on to the meter here. No, porque? I don't porque know. La yeah. no, no grab, no grab. Oh, why? Why at this moment? Why are you saving the meter? Gastate las barras. No! no! Not like this. Oh. That's why you spend. That's economy, baby. It doesn't matter. All right, 26 seconds on the clock. He could have finished it off at 38, but unfortunately decided to hold on to the meter. And uh, here comes Hugo Wong with one and a half bars. Also a big problem in Mok's team. Yeah, and, uh, Oh, it's, God. It's a character. Oh, oh double up and up. Mok is showing that he can bring the mix of La Mezcla. Okay, now we've had the chance. Going forth. No allowing into the combat hey. grab. Guero is starting to get some momentum. But the defense for Mok is good. The turn is over, allowing Mok to get out of there, trying to fish, giving some line, and uh, looking for something, but Mok is not biting, he's, he's still kicking. Kind of believed in that stand CD there against all odds and got clipped with the jump D. Wow. So strong from these young samurai. All right, Iori on anchor once again. What difference does it make here? Has to make a big one, though. Oh, oh That was great. No burn. With the, with the CD, but waking up with the grab. Ooh. And the little the little hand to make the cross up. We are gonna see the full damage. Oh, okay, being smart, going That's for all. the grab. Still a lot of damage nonetheless. Ooh, he has come, he, has it. He, he can do it. Kuzu Kage. Oh, it's up close. Oh, yeah. oh wow. all right, this happened last time. Right. We got down to the Yori, and the Yori started cooking. Oh, puede cocinar. Can he do it? El Yori de Barrio. It's kooky though, man. I don't know if people, and, people don't see it. Oh, and God. four bars. Oh, oh, what's happening? I can't oh, see! I no. can't see! What's happening? It's over in a moment. A sandstorm came from Huero Asamilla. Moke is going to move forward to the top three. But please, griten para el Huero. Make some noise from the Mexican warrior. Literally got buried in sand there. That was wild. My heart is crying, of course, but against such a strong display 
There is no argument. There is nothing to say. Only congratulations to Mock moving into the top three of EVO 2023. Wow, Japan getting so far away. Getting so far up in there, and these guys no stranger to each other. Mock always in that picture as well. But once again, Weto doing the darn thing here at this EVO 2023 KO 15 tournament. And even though he didn't make it in the top three, I think he did. He did us proud. He yeah. did everybody that plays for sure. in this region proud. So definitely give it up for Weto. And we'll definitely see more of him as we now yeah, have he, an esports tour to look forward to. <laughs> he's going to keep traveling for sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> La Sangre Azteca will return. No, Don't doubt about it. But now Asia Pacific once again at the top echelon of this KOF. Man, they are so strong. And... They play so good, so and so fun to watch. They're super like, sharp. You cannot be not entertained by these fantastic players, our visitors, our brothers and sisters from Far, th far East Asia. Definitely love to see them working. We're about to get a lot more of that. But first, we got to break the throw it to you. So we'll see you in a little bit. Stay tuned. Chipotle's new chicken al pastor is fire on every level. Fresh chicken hot off the grill. A rich marinade of seared marita peppers and ground achiote balanced with a splash of pineapple all combined for the right amount of heat. Chipotle's all new chicken al pastor is where fire meets flavor. We're back with more K-15 action here at EVO 2023 Top 6. Are you ready for the final stretch, ladies and gentlemen? Only three, only three Warriors are left. They all come from different nations, from different lands, but share the same passion on their blood, this love that you also have, the love for KOF. Man, it is feeling like we've been at this for years and it's only been two days, honestly, man. I feel like I aged like at least five years just watching these matches in top six. Yeah, man, it's been such a, ra a rail ride, a thrill ride, sorry. Oh, oh English failing, that Roller only coaster, means hype is climbing. At this point, we say what we're comfortable with, man. So if you gotta drop it in the native tongue, I'm all about oh. it. No, no, people, people here in the production team will look at that. No, no, no. <laughs> we're gonna keep it in the universal tongue English. Con un poquito de español. So we are going to keep out, yeah, the picture. We are all friends and brothers bound by KOF. Now we are going to see Moke against Shao, no, sorry, E.T. E.T. Oh, man. E.T. having a hell of a match with uh, Shao Hai in w w winner's finals. Gone down to loser's finals here. This will be three out of five, and he's going to be fighting his way, hopefully to get another shot at Shao Hai, or it could be Moku, the young upstart, with an opportunity uh, with a shot at the king. Yeah, man. So good. I want to see E.T. try to prove that that Isla is one of the best characters in the game. She has so many options. Maybe some people say that she lacks in the damage department, but it doesn't matter when you can Consistent open up. Consistent damage is still up, pretty good. Open up. And of course, I want to see that beautiful, beautiful Korean, Korean kick lady 
the Taekwon. You want long. to see that long get yeah. down, huh? The grind. Well, to be honest, we haven't, we haven't seen that much of her during this top six. Like, Mok has been so dominant with Vigenet that uh, Long has fallen uh, outside of the spotlight. I think uh, the few times that she did get to really cook, uh, it, was it was a monstrosity, but we quickly ended up seeing Kukri, who just emptied the sand buckets, you know? Yes. Kicked over the sand castle and buried his opponent. Let's see, again, this is a game about air superiority. Who is going to be the queen of Earth? We know that, of course, Jenny is a queen of the seas, but here Isla is trying to deliver something. The cross-up is not going to hit. So the rolls of Mok are also very interesting. He has Whoa. Won. Oh, forget about what I was saying, because right now, E.T. is landing the first big damage. I was going to say, man, we already know E.T. kind of likes this matchup. The B's and A versus Isla, not entirely uncomfortable with it. Might even feel there's an advantage for his Isla. Yes, you are completely right. 50% is gone, one opening was enough for Mox to try to make it something. Where are you going? Bro, look at that range! I have hands, I both hands. What's the what's that uh the JoJo's they're pointing at him like go ahead? Yeah. Get get her. Now here she is. Luong. Is she going to do her craft? Is Mock going to cook with her? Okay, the slap. He's so ready. The defense from Mock is so good. And finally we're gonna slam that girl to the ground, keeping it on. Are we going to spend it? Yes, I, here I, we I, go. I, I agree. Make the economy grow. Spend the money. Definitely going to get all that life back as well there. If you might have held on to it for a little too long, you might not get 100%. And here comes the PGA on ET side. Opening it with Harrier B, as expected. Side Tai Ho. Not working. Patient by Mob. But the moment that he wanted to go forward, he's going to get heavily punished in the moves. Trying to stay out of the corner, but no. Uh, E.T. is not allowing that to happen. Finally, use the guard cancel to get out of there and escape with a crime right there in Carol Park. And you were mentioning earlier how we didn't get to see much of the long, and I think largely because her defense is very strong. There's not a lot uh, going on in the anti-air department. There kind of has to bet it all on a well-placed down C or a low B going underneath a misplaced jump attack. Uh, but E.T. not falling for either one of those scenarios. And those were two bars spent on the guard cancels to get out of the pressure from E.T. and was unable to do it. So that's big money lost for Mog and E.T. is moving forward and now Kukri is against the corner contra las cuerdas. Oh, but he's gonna fight his way out. Yeah, Kukri can box though. That's a deceptive fact about him. He can definitely in fight. And we are going from coast to coast because now is E.T. the one who... Oh, that was so nasty. Las la no. Cochinas, disgusting move over there by Mog, who is finally waking up with his character. I believe that's safe on that. Oh, he got him! Oh, made him look. I am in a, your head. Uh -huh. Let's see, but we are going to have Cronin with, with almost four bars. And that can... Uh, turn sand into glass, that's for sure, and yes, we are gonna see it sure can, immediately. Man. Oh no, 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 no. Take a hard knockdown, continue to pressure Mr. Corner because he wants that EXDT to be available for the extra damage possibly. And to kill as possible. If possible, sorry, in the next opening. Four bars again, man. Oh! oh wow! Bang! Uh, bringing the gun into a fist oh, fight. Had it. Oh, and with it we have the, the tricky stuff. Uh, E.T. bringing the tricky, tricky stuff. Ooh, that was rough, man. I don't think that Mok was ready to punish that whiff, but hey, it worked out for E.T., right? People would say that it was on purpose. I will say that. That, 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 was, say that, that was the meatiest time. of buttons, mm -hmm. not, a, not a whiff. The meatiest. The meatiest. <laughs> you speak the water up. <laughs> Carnosito. Oh, boy. So let's see. Mm -mm. In uh, the push forward, what changes, what uh, evolution can Moke show us right here, right now? I'm actually expecting to see E.T. if he can actually perform better in this matchup, even though it did go his way overall. Uh, I think he really likes this matchup for E.T. It looks like it. Oh, great. Just pressing the button yet again. He's so ready for the anti but now he will have to live in this corner. And how is how is E.T. going to ski, escape? Mm. Mm. Oh, oh, that's gonna hurt. What's in my mind? It's in your mind, and the reefs are on. The prediction. Oh, sadly, no punisher there, and the, and, and everything has turned around. Oh yes. The damage incoming. This is what 
He, he needed Bot Mocha says no, I'm gonna wake up with a grab. Oh, right back at ya! Jiren and they're both playing a very steady pace and they're almost even on life. It's the break in, that's gonna be it for Bijane, but the damage was below. Uh, looking like 20%, 25% there, and I'm sub 30 seconds. Not a lot of life, not a life coming back to this Isla. Kind of an easy job for this long here. Might just spin one bar. Oh, oh. 11 will be the punish. Nah, too yeah, it's a little difficult to punish that. Yeah, to be honest, and I like that Mokka didn't work for it, but it doesn't matter because he's gonna get opened up going for the reset, but Mokka was ready again. His uh, defensive options are always on point. To be honest, for this young Japanese player, blowback to two of them and the cross-up in the last moment, we're gonna have Luong with 60-70% health and a lot of salsa. He's going to have money to invest and I want to see the beautiful Taekwondo. No word. She's starting. That's actually kind of problematic for the PGNA. If she's gonna go for the EX Hind and the, the wall can just kick, uh, do her wheel kick out of the, out of the way, they can punish it. Oh, here we go. Here we go. No. Oh, the shutter strike. So no damage. Not seen. Oh, no. Adamant, no, what a drop. No lo tires. Why now? Uh, all over the floor. Uh, yeah, I hate to see this kind of thing happen. Okay. Get him out. He became uh, made out of uh, smoke, <laughs> running away from there. La chica de humo. Oh, he chased but the He's going uh, to chase that role. And sadly, we are not seeing that much of Luong from Mok. I hope he's able to uh, keep this game up so we can see more of it. Well, three bars with a creepy definitely helps out in that department. We might get to see the Cronin here, but I imagine the way he's playing this right now, we're definitely going to see uh, BGNA take her 50% uh, out of Kukri's blood. Indeed, uh, that's a lot of work that the man of sand has to do. El hombre de arena, trying oh, to bring boy. something. The sand man. Are, are we gonna? Are we gonna play some metal? Fuck it. bro. That's a that's a good down C there. I don't know a lot of people that play Kukri, but they definitely Ooh, from the, the down C. He made a bet all the way over there, going for the overhead kick, here. but he is able to deliver. Last characters, Cronin, three bars. Kukri will have to play oh, humble. Play honest, and he's spending them a little bit out of range. All right, looking for uh, possibly an extension from uh, Utida. Catching the overhead, ooh, jump CD, best jump CD in the business. Ooh, ooh. Using the clones. And Echo, they get out of the corner somehow. Once Echo Warrior. Ooh. Careful! Ooh. Again, trying to stay out of that range, but ET is still Climbing off that uh, resources bar. Yeah, threatening right and now. And little by little, Mock is spending all of his money in uh, very little, to be honest. Yeah, uh, oh, Kukri finally. definitely can put damage up on you real quick. He needs resources for that. So it's going to be a, another touch before he actually puts it. Oh, oh no! <coughs> that was a bait! Yeah. I am sure that was a bait from ET. Disgusting at the big boot. No defense on his board. He has to teleport out. Oh, he just got hit by the He has a last chance for the challenge! Ready. No respect! E.T. without fear. That popped him up in the air. I don't know if he jumped or back dashed or what, but that was unfortunate. Yes, yes. Waking up with Barons, man. Cero miedo. No fear at all over there by E.T. Doing in a fantastic way. You gotta do what you gotta do. Yes, and he, he, I love that he's not playing with headphones, man. He's feeling the crowd. Oh, yeah, man. He's listening to them. A fan of enjoying the ambiance, as it were. I love that from a good player. Look at him. He feels comfortable. He knows that this is a step in order to get his revenge and make history here on the Evo stage. And meanwhile, Moku might be getting a little sweaty here. And mm -hmm. might get a little bit more hard pr production work out of him, man, because just not finishing off. ET just wants to ahead of him in the most pivotal mo moments. Let's see. Because Isla has been the key <laughs> for all of these uh, victories yeah, for ET. Like how much damage was it, uh, was Mok able to do to Wera Samilla with uh, with Jenny, mm -hmm. with the Pirate Queen, and uh, ET is shutting her down, and that's a big uh, variable in this uh, in this fight. Oh, great punish over there, reaching with the carrier and spending the bar in order to get all that uh, real state uh, with the corner carry. Yeah, you, you play this game enough and you start feeling great when you're like, you know, up a character. But some people, I feel okay as long as uh, they got the resources. I feel like ooh, ET ooh. himself is okay as long as he's playing this particular matchup the way he wants to play it, win or lose. That was on the same side, I believe. I don't know. I got opened up, that's for sure. 
challenge over there by ET. Great blocks. All, right. All of the players that have been attempting to do those cross-ups to Mok have not been successful. He is so ready on that defense side. That's a stat. Yeah. I, well, I am not counting. <laughs> <laughs> I suck at math, that's for sure. <laughs> Oh. Mark with a great turnaround here, putting the BGNA into the secondary here. Uh, going up against BT's secondary. Ooh! Whoa, it's gonna be enough for level two. That's 50 seconds. You might get close to 100% health back there. Oh, get all the health. Oh, just a smidge and lift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, you can count it. You can count it. Now, can, can Wong finally provide for the Japanese Samurai, but AT is so ready. Perfect placement on that EX Hind. How are you gonna get out of here? How are you going to escape from the Vulcanic Queen? That's so he's smart! It out and he that. made it in time! So that's what I was talking about the previous game. He's using that EX wheel for the, the wheel kick in the air to change the trajectory of the jump, fade out the EX time and get the punish. Ooh. So close for the Shutter Strike. But there are no resources yet again for Mock. Always playing humble because of the use of the bar during this match. Get oh. him! So good. He's gonna get the bar. Is he going to spend it? Yes! To push it against the corner once more. Give it some line, give it some breathing space. He wants E.T. to make a mistake. Ooh, that's the NCD is such a menace. You are, oh, that's gonna be it, that's get gonna be it. opened up. Wong. He didn't want to roll, man. I don't blame him. Wong, it's out. Jet again to Kukri. He can do it. He did it last time. I'm playing very, very safe. But now E.T. is on a hunt. He is pressuring on, and look at this. You're already in this situation. You love to be on the corner. He spends the bar to get out of there. Yeah, man, he's just throwing out all the meaties right now. Moku unable to escape his left, right, next up. Ooh, the big cross up! It's gonna be big damage. One more setup. That's all oh, the instant overhead. All right, that's exactly what Moku needed. He needs to get rid of his right now. 40 seconds on the clock. He's gonna get a lot of life back here, but only one bar to work with. 50%. 50%. Kukri with two bars grown, and if he gets another one, it's a touch of death. Mm -hmm. And this is the last game from Moku if he wants to survive for another one. Otherwise, he's going home. Okay. Let's see. Teleports. Oh, oh trying to feel him out there. He's betting, and he's not winning. Oh, wow, okay. that's it. No, no cutel. Okay. Against the corner. He's fighting his way out. He is oh, he's not respecting. It's not your turn. I'm pressing buttons. Oh, he wants to bait it out so bad right now. He's like, come on, give me another one. Oh. Oh, he got him. Oh, got the him. Got him. Quick draw, McGraw, E.T. takes it and loses final 3-0. And he is going to have his run back, the young boy, growing in to be a world champion. Make some noise for Maku. What an answer to that presser. Moku yes. felt desperate that he had to continue the offense by any means necessary, and E.T. just played him like a fiddle. You just have to give them one chance, to these level of players, one chance, and they will take it. Moku says thank you to the crowd. He is going home with a very, very honorable third place. But now it's about, we saw heroes. Now we are seeing tight ends. We're actually here, man. This is the run back from 2017 Grand Finals. E.T. Shao High. Oh, so much. So the big. legend continues, Are man. you ready, people? Are you ready? This is the last, the last stretch. Two warriors are here. Two warriors of legend. Both EVO champions. And they want another stick, another golden stick on their collections. I'm telling you, bro, like this matchup back in 2017 sent chills through my spine. A lot oh, of time, yes. the way they were playing that so intensely, everything was perfect. And then the diamond moment, don't wake daddy occurred. <laughs> Are we going to see it happen again? Is this don't wake daddy part two? No, no, it's going to happen, man. Don't wake Cronin. And, and again, like the, the team that are being used in these moments by ET, uh, I like it, man. Like they are really pushing forward the meta of this game in such a way it's like we want we are able to uh, to expect this shift as we see et there ready to face his uh, strongest strongest rival and he's looking super sharp right now uh, he looked sharp at the beginning of the day he's looking sharper now and there he is there he is with the technology don't look at it. 
You don't deserve this attack. I'm sorry, man. That box is tripping me out. Cause like, what if he just makes like a sudden motion to the right and just rips it open, right? Now, have you seen him play? Like he's, he's, he's gotta have such calm hands. Yeah, it's like, yeah, they, yeah. they never move. He's like programming, bringing the code or something. Not me, man. I can roll up on that. Like, ah, give me that DP. On the rage. Oh yeah. On the rage. No, but we are talking about Shao Hai right here. I am sure, like he is, like a, like a master pianist. You're bringing a symphony. You know what? I wouldn't be surprised if he does play piano. Yeah, he could, yeah, for sure. He definitely looks like he plays piano. <clears throat> Let's go. Let's go. Because we have indeed two artists of their craft, the best of the business. And look at this crowd. These are the grand finals. Why are you not making noise? Can't hear them, baby. Make the world know that this is KOF. I think they're ready for it. Yes, yes, they are. Beautiful people, La Familia in the zenith of this tournament on the toppest point. It only can get better pockets. Here we go, Grand Finals. Okay. Give me the hand. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Dude, I could not think of a better place to be than right here with everybody ready to witness the colossal class that's about to occur. Shout out to everyone that's made this happen so far, the production staff, the other commentators, the players themselves, the audience, the fans, the sponsors, the viewers, SK, SK. It's all so, coming down to this. Such a big family, man. All united worldwide by the love of this beautiful, beautiful game and all of the passion that we have for fighting games. Let's go. Here it is. Last but not least, the pool judges. Oh, the Pray judges. for them, baby. The voluntaries, <laughs> yeah. Warriors, true, true warriors on the brackets. But here we go. We go to the winter wonderland in order to make things happen as cool as it can be. It's gonna be a hush over the crowd for this one, man, because this is gonna be so tense right now. These guys have had absolutely legendary matches in the past, and I don't expect that this will be any different. And Shao Hai pushing forward with his Kyo. Isla unable Ooh. to deal with it all, but Ooh. now finally gets the opening. A little bit of a mid-space jump, and E.T. is going to provide from it. Nice. Oh, the, the little knee, perfectly way, going for the kick, but Isla is more than ready with those big anti -airs. Oh, pressing the buttons. That's how I move forward, baby. Oh, out of that. What a great back hop to stay out of the dirty hands of Don't that criminal. Mm -hmm. What's that, that counter here once again for the split kicks pickup? Wow, it just goes in! Yeah. Why not? Oh, exactly, why I can not? do it! <laughs> You could do it too if you pick Kyo, of course. Yeah, we are not playing neutral today, buddy. <laughs> no footsies. I have so much options. Ooh! And the big mistake by ET. Shao Hai is gonna take this gift that he's gonna do the most out of it. 50% out of your life by one mistake. This is what happens when you play against Kyo. Yo, Kusanagi. what? <laughs> you had that opening? Oh, oh, good guard cancel there. Level We're two. Get that damage. Mm. He's out of there. I do agree. Get that boy out of the way. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. still a lot of meters spent, but hey, I agree. Uh, like you said, we're going to go up against this here uh, two-bar Isla. And yeah, uh, shall I sticking to the Isla secondary pick here? Very interesting. It was the challenge last time. It works out. Let's go. In this specific scenario, too. Oof. Oof. The activation, and look at that. Also getting the after hit. Oh, the On the same side, side the no mix up mix up. Oh. Tricky, tricky stuff, uh, la cochinada de Shao Hai. Well, she has so many options mm. in the air that you have to think about. Sometimes the simple one's the one you forget. Yeah, man. And, and it's the one that also brings the most emotional damage because, <laughs> because you feel uh, like a fool. You're like, oh, I just didn't block? Wow. Mm. And he's like finally sh showing up. Oh! Bao Shao Hai with a statement. Yo! Oh, what an action! Are you there. kidding me? Oh, we're gonna have a fight back. He has some resources. On the same side also, not going for, for the change. Bro, another mistake? What's going on with E.T.? I, I, I don't know what he thought he was doing there, but... Oh, big, big mistake over here, and E.T. will have to shake that from his mind. He has a reason to work on. He has to beat this legend six times in a row. So he needs to forget about those mistakes and look into the future pockets. Yeah, I know. I get to forget about it, too, because I'm trying to figure out what he was trying to do there. But at the same time, maybe he meant to do the level one super. So he's got to move on beyond that. And we are hopefully going to get a sharper E.T. in the second game of this grand final set. But e uh, Shao Hai, on the other hand, giving him all he can handle. Let's see. Okay, oh, he's like up and go. 
This is what E.T. needs. His opening character to control this Kyo Kusanagi, who has been doing so much damage on all these top six. Yeah, that low B that East was utilizing there, almost reminiscent of the cool low B in season one, where you jumped on and you just got hit. It just indeed, just as the B Janet one. Now, okay. The, the force now reaching. Just a bit outside. And, and out of character, misses spaced bottom over there by Shao Hai, but now he lands at it. He will go with the bodegas. Staying out of there? No. No confirm. The, so, the second jump of Shao Hai was so ready. That was a little telegraph's cold. I don't know, man. That was huge for Shao Hai, though. No punch. Big punch. Oh my god, he had it, but he dropped. Oh, oh no. he yeah. opened okay, up. He got that's him. What, that's what he needed. He needed that to change. The most complex Okie Doke setup I've ever seen. Oh, <laughs> if we are going to take it as that. Now in the mirror, ET is going to take it super fast. Hmm. Confirming it, yes, but it's an eBay game. And Kyo is out of the way. This is good for ET. He needed to get that opening character first. Oh, man. Pace is blistering right now. Now, forward with a few fuse, with a car. Yes. Keep the engine running, right? Yeah. Maintaining the momentum, that's the plan over here. What a block over there oh, by ET, but it doesn't matter. ET getting hit by his own grime. He's definitely thinking about front side, left side, and this time it was back side. Just only human. You are only human. But, but, but okay, he's fighting back. Going all the way over there, not spending any kind of research. Just wanted to keep oh. the combo. That was big. He has the corner. Oh, sadly he gets into it. No open up, and he gets kicked like a dog. Kicking the shins. Stop approaching, he said. Okay, okay, middle side of the middle part of the stage. Opening up for on the below zone. Shao Hai so good. Shao Hai's comfortable with this character. Catching right that now. Backup. The, the oh. character switch totally in his favor right now. Not allowing ET to build up any momentum. Oh, God. oh the slap. Getting the girl into the corner. Oh, again. And immediately spending the resources in order to do a match, cronin as much as possible. Says Shao Hai DP for you. Very interesting take by Shao Hai. Having his own crush back. Oh no! Oh, my heck nah. The dirty hands trying to catch something, but out of range. Get over here. La mano negra. Oh no! I like, I like, I like oh. it. 26 seconds left on, the, left on the clock. You definitely want to get the most of that. It's going to be super even. Shao Hai will have a little bit extra bar. Two and a, two and a quarter. But ET will build his own in a first touch. There we go. Oh! Perfect timing on that low A, but no commitment to the slide afterwards from ET. Don't do it, ET. Don't do us. Activation. They will have the activation. It's gonna be big. But of course, farm for killing and Shao Hai have the advantage. At least in resources. All right, no uh, max mode available anymore. But eat Shao Hai with three bars. That's gonna be a kill situation. Yeah, it doesn't matter what happens. A touch. It's the okay. touch of death. The ladronen. Okay, are Hageyo. This is such a bad mouth boy. Oh, Ooh, that's humongous! But the, the humble crone and it's unable to deliver the kill. Couldn't get an extra bar there, unfortunately. And it's still one touch territory for DT, giving three bars for Shao Hai. Oh, Shao Hai playing, and he knows that he has the touch. He has the touch! Oh, oh didn't get the anti air no. there. Does he have the power? No! no! Way! The reaction! He doesn't have the power! DT! Don't clutch that! That's. Like a hero! Oh boy! Well, we are in base. Oh, yeah, you have to bet. You have to place the odds to Lady Lock. Mm -hmm. Shout out to that Terry, by the way. Didn't think he had that EXDP on deck, sorry, bro. Oh, look at these people so happy. Oh, la familia, ya está padrino! Let's go. Let's go, having such a moment right here on Las Vegas, Nevada, on the stage of Evo. Shao Hai against mm. ET Legends, battling for your glory, for your entertainment, people. All right, best. And Shao Hai has any cool players left in the pocket right now, he needs to whip them out. Oh, that guard point, baby. It is so generous. Yeah, indeed. <laughs> oh, and then again, just to learn the lesson. Schooling right now and against, look at the corner. Oh, the shatter strike! That's gonna be it for Isla, man. It, Maximum offense from Shao Hai here. It reaches so far, mm -hmm. it will always touch. And Shao Hai now deciding that his Kyo will be almost full health. One bar, the perfect start to keep the dominance of Shao Hai into this stage. Yeah, man, can ET slow it down, though? Shao Hai right now putting the pedal to the metal, going 80 miles a minute. Oh, let's see. The Harriers are not going to kick, the pressure is on. 
Kio is wanting to fight his way out with the Bodegas. But of course, the Harriers are so, always such a viable, and they are hitting. And we are going to get something. No. No, we got to hold all of that and get pushed out of the corner, though. That's a pretty beneficial situation for Shaohai. Look at all that real estate. Shaohai is trying to get bought. The challenge from E.T. is so good. E.T. said, did I catch you trying to jump again? I thought we talked to you this lesson the last time. Oh, my God. You were thinking that you have a chance. But I'm going to wake up with the P.P. The Taiho. Let's see. Neutral yet again. So 30 seconds. Uh, E.T. still on a secondary here. And this is gold for Shaohai. Mm -hmm. Every hit, every second spent. If we reach 90, oh, Arachinagi! He, no, he no, took no. it, he took it too long! Wow, what a mistake, but still the damage is done. Like, yes, it, it hurts, but not that much. Not that much. Uh, it's Vision A and very easy kill territory for the Isla. Oh, there it is. And uh, reaching is it's just that, like, deja vu. We saw this on game number one. Mm -hmm. The confirm as she's falling, yes. Golden letters for Shao Hai having the road all clear to take this game number three. One full character up over the anchor Cronin. Though the anchor Cronin does have five bars here, very dangerous. Oh, yes. But how much? The, the question, oh, how much oh, would oh, you oh, spend? Oh. Uh, all of it right now, man. Oh, it seems that E.T. wants to, ke to keep some on his pocket. That's me, though. That's why he's up there and I'm over here. <laughs> Getting the fourth one immediately. So this Cronin is still super dangerous. One big boot and one level one uh, and one, one and a half bars would be enough to end uh, Isla. But Chaohai is fighting this. Oh, what a reaction over there with the DP so ready. Yeah, the it's, DX, it's, wow, he whipped it down. See? Mm. It's, it's what I was telling you. One and a half bars. Now he's not going to have the life lead here, but I think the momentum definitely is feeling like it's in ET's hands right now. It's his even. This is even, Pockets. Can he steal the game? Shao Hai had so much of an advantage. Oh, oh that's gonna hurt. Full, full mm. combo, full combo. Big the gun. Bang! Not an, I should stop something. That, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was so close to the ground, man. I thought he was going to miss it. I thought he was gonna miss it also. I was like, that was oh. tragic. And be ready, people. Be ready. Estén listos. This is tournament point. Evil point for Shao Hai. Kwamba Doji's own. Are we not going to get a bracket reset here? On a kill of tournament? Just curse, I just curse it. <laughs> all, a, all production's looking at me right now, just like they want to cuss me out. <laughs> on a KOF of tournament, no reset? Yeah. That's, that's, <laughs> that's an exotic situation for sure. What? Oh, Bariga. Not, not in the right spacing, though. And the pressure, yeah, great. The grab over there. The Shao Hai always changing the rhythm pocket. He's so uh, flexible, so variable, like, like water itself. Ooh. I'm liking to change the pace here for E.T. Oh, let's see the damage that, that E.T. was able to provide over there. I, I oh. wonder if the EX Oniyaki can punish that uh, rush kick. I don't know. I, mean, I, I don't think we're going to find out, obviously, because this might be it for... Yeah, he's going for the double up kicks. And with the dancing Kyo, the turning boy, we are going to E.T.'s second character, B. Janet. She has to really provide right now because Kyo is looking healthy. Healthy, one and a half bars almost, and just cooking up with Oh, oh wow. And now you are, in, you are caged. You are in your room, and that is scolding. That is hitting hard. Shao Hai right now just putting on a clinic with this kill pressure. <gasps> All right, good response from ET. Two bars left. He's going to hold, hold. That's right, hard knockdown. What's up next? Oh, he went for the C, but Shao Hai did not let go. Keeping Jump. patience with the defense, knowing that each one of these hits is big. Yo! Oh, spend the bar yeah, for the EX Reka. Yeah, chip damage over there. Making Kyo get to his knees. Not a bad round for ET's Bijan A there. He finally got the kill out of there. Uh, decent amount of life coming back to him as well. But this Isla has been kind of a problem for him as well. He's kind of getting a taste of his own medicine here. Yeah, but all of those times, like, he was ending uh, Big Janet with one combo, right? Mm -hmm. She will have the time to leave a little bit longer this time. Yeah. Uh, but we will have the setup here. Let's see. Blocks. Good stuff over there by E.T. Still staying alive. The uh -oh. Harriers finally to get out of there. Spending one bar. Moving forth on the other side. Oh. Cross up. You would never believe that would cross up until it actually does. Spend it. Spend it. Let's go. Another one. Oh, what a great anti-air from E.T. just in time. So not going to give you the opportunity. Oh, you who? <laughs> oh, oh, he had yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Hello, it was a little too high. He had it. He had it. Let it go. Began it trying to stay alive. 
Isla with four bars, providing all of that delicious, delicious salsa to Cronen. Whoa, what but a challenge. still fighting. Patience from Shanghai in such a fantastic way, finding the moment where it is going to make the mistake. And now we have a very, very dangerous Isla with nothing to lose. <laughs> Corner, not even, man. Four bars. She gets a touch. She, I, I would expect me to go. Oh, the challenge over there with the DP. Good on in. Saving it for Anchor Cronin, bro. It's coming down to this. And this Here is we it. Go. Here this we go, is guys. It. This is KF15, Cronin against Cronin. There are five bars for Shao Hai. Can this be the end? Are we going home or are we getting another game? Are we crowning him? Let's go. Oh, great DP yes, by ET. He's he saying no. Shut up, masked man. <laughs> I can make it. <laughs> Stop jinxing. Believe. <laughs> Gotta believe in yourself, man. ET definitely leaving in the buttons here. 6A, finding the mark. Imagine, imagine this crowning with five bars. It's so dangerous, man. Like, Ooh, I don't think gone, but he's gonna get the read. Coming up. Like, he gets we the three bars. It. That's it. It's it. We're, We're going to find the game. Yeah! Believe! Ooh. You gotta believe! Make noise, people! Game number five. Yeah, ET! I just want to apologize to the production staff right now. My bad. <laughs> you have to believe! That's why we are here! Woo! What a clutch play from ET there, man. Wow. Oh, fantastic. What a way to send this game on this stage. The pressure, what are they? Are? Oh, he's saying it. I got this. He's becoming Mexican. I'm feeling it. Oh, I'm feeling it too. Oh. Will this play out as it did in 2017, man? Ooh. ET. Let's go, guys. Rainy game number five. Can I, can I hear a shout for game number five? <laughs> there it is. Oh, opens up the stand CD. Tremendous. And it looks like he has the momentum on his side, but the patience, the cool way of playing of Shao Hai, always dangerous, so stoic, so well posed, always pocket. Yeah, no, nah, and Shao Hai. Oh, ah, so privileged. Why? Oh, oh, yeah, he's the poster boy. Don't forget that. Oh, the grab. No, no EX come and grab it. Interesting. Mm -hmm. He's like, it's out of there. Oh, but the kick. What a challenge. What an option. What a pickup. Mm. Oh, yeah, I he like wanted. Like it. Don't yeah. go down like that. Don't go down like that. He wanted to go for the chip. Of course. Oh, 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 oh he thought it was going to be a run grab. Oh, oh my God. What a clutch play. Oh, he's feeling it. And now in the mirror match. Of course, one touch from Chao Kai could meal the end. Oh! oh, he went for the double cross-up. That was deep enough, too. Oh, ah! no. Overextension by ET is going to cost the character. And uh, Chao Kai with the advantage now in terms of the money. El dinerito. All right, man. What does this Bishon A do? Keep it solid. Stay steady. Just has to get down past the Isla. Oh, that's a big hole. one. Oh, but he makes, he picks it up. No! Whoa. Full punish over here. That is unfortunate. Look at that. Look at all that real state from side to side. Mm -hmm. Trying you. to go for the fake. Tally Ho says the pirate girl, but no. He's like fighting back. She wants to, de to deliver Pisco. No rum, no rum, no bones. Shall I say my Isla ain't out of it yet? What a oh, jump in! Oh, wow. my lord! How, how is he able? To make that big mistake at the start, shake it off and, and begin to play again like the best. That mental forty to this insane pocket. Only a true master, as they say, Rahul. Oh God! And now Shao Hai is going. We're going back into it. Very close there in every way. Shao Hai will come. Two bars. Can Et do it again? Can we have a bracket reset right here? Mm. Oh, the people want they, it. They want more KOF, and I do not blame them. Get oh. punished. Grab it to grab. The overhead, oh. stop on him. No respect. One more. Oh, he's like, nah, oh. I admitted that, bro. I have, the, I have the same character. I know it. That's my gimmick. Oh, here oh, we go. RC. There is no resources enough. We are playing combo cronings right here, Los Humildes. About to get another bar right there. OK. Next touch is going to win for ET. Possibly oh. not for Shao High. How can you jump against this character? They are madmen. He's going to oh. get two bars from this. 
Next touch is gonna kill. Okay, here we go. EX, just to stay alive. Trying Ooh. to get for something. Great block. He's staying alive against the corner. He's pushing on. He's going forward. Gets gonna go hit. To He's gonna get guard broken. Where is the DP coming? Oh, we got the grab. He's gonna get that guard meter back. So He's even. Over. He's gotta give up on it. The Two bars again. Everything is trembling right now on Las Vegas. Oh, no, I'm gonna see it. it. Shao Hai, only one touch away. The patience, oh my god. ETS have a clutch play again. Oh, no, the oh, real baby! Ahora yo! Ahora yo! He's going to take it so close. Oh, man. Denying the reset, denying the glory. Shao Hai is your Evo 2023 champion! Well deserved, man. Oh Evil my God. Japan champion, now Evil World champion. Wow, man. What a monster. What a legend. Make some noise! Make his champ, make your champ listen to it. Oh my God, what a tournament. What a crowd. What a moment to be alive. Oh, look at that. So fantastic. So good. Buckets. So many memories. After this, the glory of all the world, the most humble of games, on the biggest of stages. Everyone united for the passion of this fantastic, fantastic title. Ah, what a fantastic way to sign off this year's KOF 2023. Yeah, With man. authentic KOF, humble KOF, no bars, only neutral. Heck oh. of a tournament, Cole. Heck of a tournament. Glad to have spent it with my friend. Uh, I couldn't have shared it with someone else, man. Thank you very much for having me here to the Evo crew, to every single one who makes this event possible. As you were saying, the voluntaries, the production crew, our eye in the sky who have been making sure this reach all over the world. Look at these champions. These are your top six players, and of course, your champion. Make some noise! Or he got second place at 3 tournament. Matt KOF won the 3 tournament. Yeah, you're completely right. Yeah, so, so great. Uh, this is just so, so many, so yeah, many great characters. And so and many players. great players, man. Starting with Lassit in fifth place, baby. Give it up for him. Heck of a weekend, man. Heck of a weekend. And up next, we got Matt KOF. Ah, and in fourth place, Bueno Asamilla, baby. De la pura ciudad. Give it up for the kid. On third place, we are going to have Moku. For the second place, make, make some noise for the man who made us believe, E.T. And oh man, E.T. is going to qualify for that SNK World Tour final spot since Shao Hai already received the spot from EVO Japan. But man, this guy's indomitable in first place, your EVO champion, Shao Hai! Woo! These, of course, are your champions.